Welcome back to Starfield. I don't think we've done much story, but that's okay. We're gonna go. We're gonna play. We're gonna have a good time. So pretty. I'm really vibing with this. Don't worry about it. They were missing audio files. Everyone else it was working, but it was just me. Right. I still want to steal this man's ship. I'm going to go find out what's happening. How's my inventory space? 104. Actually, you can see it here. It's 145 out of 160. So let me see what our situation is. Because I just, I simply do not believe. I simply do not believe. Why am I carrying so much alcohol? <laughs> I don't believe that there's any way that I can't steal that ship. Excuse me. Oh, I don't really want to store all the food, but whatever, that's okay. Sounds like the Colo way to me. I would argue it's the Psyche way because the psych I'm playing like a Psyche, but that's just me. I am familiar with the Colo way though. It's a good way to enjoy a game. Toast. I don't need to bring toast. Can I store some resources? Why do I have three coffee bags? I'll do for now. I'm gonna go try and steal this ship. Murder everyone. Don't, th don't know if I would drink alcohol out of a juice pouch. Not sure it's wise. Not sure it's wise. All right, where's that ship? Where am I? Why is there a random helmet on the floor? Why am I cold? Did I? I have questions. Oh, wait, we're are we not on the planet any? No, we are. Where was that ship? Did it take off? Did they leave? Did they leave? Their pilot really was still alive? This is the same planet, isn't it? I didn't make that up. Did I make that up? Soul is in the game, yes. This is uh, not Soul. Did I make that up? Is this a completely different place? Why are you space? <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> we rescued Barrett from, I say rescued, we, we found Barrett is a better way of describing what actually happened. Um, but wrong planet. I think I might be in the wrong planet. I also have no memory of this place, but unfortunately do not have the button. Oh, I have the weightlifting thing I need to do. Right, hang on. There was a ship. Was it not here? Was it in a previous place? I've forgotten. It was literally yesterday. Am I okay? Also, is there anything up here? A lot of red lights. We all know that's bad, right? Twenty percent extra damage versus robots. Ooh. Hoggies. Hi, Sarah. Right, hang on a second. What do you mean? I have a poison rifle, and now I have this. That does so much damage. Twenty-seven caliber. Is that the same? No, it's not. Oh, it might be as the... Oh, no, never mind. It's really not. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to use the ugly little gun. Uh, it has... Lacerate randomly applies a bleed effect. Cool. I have a question. What does this mean? Ambient cold. That's what that means. Look at my ugly little gun! <laughs> Such an ugly little gun. All right. Okay, that looks like booze. So I think we killed everybody that was at this place. And I think I've probably looted it to hell and gone. But I 
too short. Didn't we have another ship somewhere? Or was that at the previous? That might have been at the previous place. It's a pea shooter. I think it might be. Okay. Well, all right. That's fine. Need to stick a jumper on. Ambient cold. Next question. Thanks for answering the question the UI answered. You're so smart, bestie. <laughs> All right, I don't think there's anything more for me to steal here. And I'm pretty sure that the thing I'm thinking of might be on a different planet. If the Crimson Fleet's been here, they might have stashed some loot. Oh my God, you know what's really great? That I can actually hear her now because I plugged my headphones in correctly. Imagine doing that. <laughs> Imagine doing that. All right. I think we might have actually moved to a different planet. It just happens to look very similar, which is unfortunate because I really wanted to steal that guy's ship. Ransacked research I post. Oh, what's that? Aluminum. Aluminium. I'm going to call it aluminum because that is what it is called in the game. I will do it that respect. Actually, no, I won't because I'm sorry. You Americans would call it aluminum even if it said al aluminium. So I'm just going to call it aluminium. <laughs> I'm not going to argue about what which is correct because I am aware that aluminum was apparently the original spelling. But I ain't going to argue about it. It's true, McDuff. <laughs> I pronounced freedom correctly. <laughs> Dr. Sparkle Pants, get out. You've been Americanized. Oh no. Both are wrong. What are we going to call it instead then, Pope Rap? What are we going to call it instead? You might not argue, but I will. <laughs> Can you find Paul Mescal on the streets of Ireland and tell him to marry me? Thanks. All right, Fergie, I'll do my best, but I'm wearing my pajamas right now, so... Call it alloy and it's always right. You'll say gas station and cr uh, trash. I almost said crash. I'm sorry, honey. I didn't mean to call you trash. <laughs> crash is like, wow, mom, I was just sitting here minding my own business. <laughs> All right. This is nearly fully surveyed. So I kind of want to see if I can find the last thing I need because it's at like 95%. The guy saw you hungrily eyeing his ship. So he decided to leave before you reloaded. I, do you know, I wouldn't even be surprised to be perfectly honest with you. Is there anything on the, this? This is, I'm missing a resource. I'm willing to bet it's not like a plant or something. It's going to be like a rock. Would you ever travel to space? Not with the tech we have now, I don't think. I would love to be a space cowgirl. Truly. That's why I'm playing a space scoundrel. I would love to be a space cowgirl. Like I would love nothing more than to feel like, do you know? Okay. Those of you who've watched Farscape, I love the idea of traveling in space and adventuring in space and having a great time. I just noticed something. I just noticed the audio device is wrong and that's why it's so aggressively loud. I was like, why is it so loud even though I changed the volume down? What do you mean? That's better. Just want aliens to come visit like it's about time. Seriously. Does this planet have anything else other than aluminum? Including the actual car girl outfit. Literally, yes. It was. I agree. I really loved Farscape. Farscape, I think a lot of people struggle with because of the Muppets in space angle, but it's so good. They've been here and found us lacking, I'm sure, probably. If you go to Mars and contribute to humanity in major ways, but you could never come home, would you go? It depends on if I could bring my cats. If I, if I could bring my partner and if my friends were going and my cats if i was either old enough that my cats were unfortunately no longer with me or if i could bring them with me yes let's go right now would you stream from mars absolutely contribute to humanity in meaningful ways like streaming <laughs> sorry i'm kidding also i kind of need to heal because ouch is there internet there yes or no Good question. Helmet with a Stetson stuffed inside? Literally, yes. What is that over there? There's like a facility over there. Maybe I can go see that because I think it counts towards surveying. It's 
stream would be out of this world. You're right, it would. The yeah, actress being able to play to something that was actually there, not a tennis ball on a stick. Yeah, like I liked it. I think a lot of people just see the first episode and think it's too cheesy. And initially I thought it was too cheesy for me too, but then I watched it and I was obsessed. Like it's one of my favorite series. I'm sorry. If you are the type of person who really enjoys an angsty romance filled with tragedy, but that it still has like a happy-ish ending, if you watch the full series and not just end at the end of season four, if you watch the TV movies as well. Um, it's so good. You both, you get to both have your happy ending, not like that. Um, and also, it's an in-game sandwich, Nard. Um, and also, you get to have all of the angst and pain of a tragic romance at the same time. It's, I can't explain it without spoilers. But it is perfect. No refund. No refunds! You all knew what you were getting into when you joined this stream. I really do enjoy looking at this guy, though. It's very pretty. I'm just gonna run over here. How far away is this? Why is it not marked on my map? Yeah, you need the Peacekeeper Wars. It's absolutely essential. I wonder if this guy has any mans. <laughs> no mans, Sky! There are no mans in that sky. <laughs> the bit of sky. Freddy. Wait, where? Yes, it does! <laughs> Watched the end of Farscape Season 4 again this week. What an end. The way that series got cancelled at that point is some nonsense. Had an ice cream sandwich they brought out for summer called Happy Ending. Haha. <laughs> bit of sky is your life. I'm sorry. <laughs> I would like to get to this building, but also equally, I feel like I'm running really far away from where I need to be. I, I'm trying to get my weightlifting achievement by carrying my excessive weight and spa, uh, like spa, spamming, spamming, <laughs> sprinting. <laughs> Cause look, I'd be carrying 75% or more of my upper weight capacity and I'm just I'm literally with my giant backpack doing this is there a way to play this not like a murder hobo I feel like trying non-violent options just doesn't work I know they said that passive like completely pacifist play is probably not possible but I have been able to talk myself out of conversations or out of combat I would like to see the persuasion menu become more I would like to see the persuasion menu become more uh, clear I've also managed to sneak into places instead of having to kill people but I, I do think there's going to be combat required for quite a lot of it what is this place unknown okay so the way persuasion works is I I suspect the colors rep represent how difficult they are and then the plus or minus or the plus numbers is how much of an effect it has on the bottom thing where it says persuade and then it has like three boxes you have to fill in or four boxes you have to fill in. If you have a positive result, the next result even if you fail it, you cannot fail the conversation because you've already had a positive result as your most recent result. Would you rather live on Mars in a small habitat or in a bunker on a radioactive Earth destroyed by humanity? If I had the means to survive, either would be fine. Didn't care for the last time when you just exited planet. Oh, that's just because I chose wanted. Wanted. Yeah, that doesn't happen all the time. Um, I chose wanted, and it does tell you that that will happen. <laughs> Every time I've tried talking, it's failed. Every time I try sneaking, I'm discovered and there's like 10 dudes show up. It depends on the like place. Like for example, if there's people in here, I think sneaking through to steal something would be impossible. Who would pick wanted? Chat was like, I think that's a great idea. So it's alien DNA so that your heels do less. 
Like, T took no traits on his character. I don't think there's going to be anything organic except for Barrett, but he's already on the ship. This is the goal. Yes, the goal is to fill up the four bits at the bottom. And some conversations are easier than others. So, like, one might require only three, and then others have required five. Sorry, I think I have an eyelash that has turned inwards and is poking me in the eye. Now, is that... Can I tell what that is? No. What are you? He said he didn't like any of the traits. He took unknown as his... Ooh, abandoned robotics facility. He took unknown as his um, starting uh, background. I do think one thing they should add is like in Oblivion, you used to be able to... Um, Oh, there are definitely people here. Um, you used to be able to take your own traits. Like, you could completely custom make your um, background. Your laser is genuinely freaking me out. Right, there are definitely people here. Probably shouldn't stand next to the flammable barrel. I feel like the responses you get for talking is purely random. So I find that uh, the last conversation I had, the options I used made sense for the character I was talking to, but I don't know if every conversation is going to feel that way. Um, it is not a perk. It is a piece of armor I found um, called Chameleon Ecliptic Spacesuit, and it gives me blend into the environment while sneaking and not moving. So if I sit in a corner, I blend. It's pretty cool. I want to see if there are any um, turrets in this place. They're pretty spooky. Okay, they're only level six, so I can take them. I wish you had this suit too, girl. You just found a helm. I find this in a um, jet pack. Don't blend, chat. Wait. Uh oh, shit. Whoa! Did you pick? Utility junk. headphone. Don't stock up on junk. Sarah, stop judging me. Oh, they're level 10. Shit. Well, my gun does lots of damage. He was bleeding. Neat. Sarah, this is a terrible place. I hate it here. You logged into Palea for Chapa Race. How effective is the chameleon suit in combat? Um, that's a turret. Not against turrets. I regret taking alien DNA so much. You would not believe. I can see where I'm shooting because I can't see my gun. How do you see your iron sights if you can't see your gun? Can't see my fucking gun! There is no benefit to alien DNA. <laughs> so far, there is no benefit to alien DNA. Um, it does just say that you took part in an experiment. That's literally all it says. Oh, I need to reload. Shit. Hello? Hello? Uh, what? <laughs> right, I'm going up there. I'm trying, Barry. Chat was being lewd. They weren't just being lewd though. Everyone said, how could you not take alien DNA? It's a noise it made makes me sad. I went, pseew, pseew, pseew. Skill issue. <laughs> Maybe it is. How are 
you I grew all the way over here. I suppose they did hear the gunfire. That makes sense. Surprise! Oh, that's mine. It's not yours. It's mine. A oh, fucking turret. There's probably a computer to turn them off, and I have no idea where it is. You know what? What am I doing? I have a rifle for a reason. It really needs a sight. Can't see. Oh, it's there. Really need a sight for this. Oh, I also really would like one big change. So I agree with what Duff said earlier about a mini map, but one big change I would really like. I would really like and think it's a shame that it's not possible to be able to take a mod off a weapon. Pistols don't feel good to me. Like, I feel like I miss a lot with a pistol, but I don't with everything else. When I feel like I'm pretty dead on with the crosshairs. Um, if you could take a mod off a weapon and put it on another weapon without having to just destroy it. Yeah, pistols feel like if I take my time aiming. Also, who, who, who has pistol specialization and sways this much when they're holding a weapon? No, you can't remove weapon mods. You remove them and then they just get deleted. Oh, Jesus Christ, you scared the crap out of me. Uh, I don't think there's a, an accuracy trait like outside of a weapon accuracy. Oh, do you not have any weapon perks, Neo? Jump scare. <laughs> the swagger of independence and freedom. Get out. I suppose weapons themselves have accuracy, but there's no like we uh, accuracy perk, if you know what I mean, for yourself. So like this weapon has an accuracy rating. Oh, that's a, an arc welder. This has an accuracy of 68%. Um, this has an accuracy of 69%, but they feel vastly different, if you know what I mean. Like, the pistol feels so much more inaccurate. Alright, nice. <laughs> Reb, good morning, by the way. Good afternoon, technically. Solu helping with the bingo. Such a friend. So beautiful. So bold. Sorry, I am literally going to call you Bolt now forever. There's somebody up there and they have forgotten that their friends were just shooting their guns at literally a second ago. But okay, that's fine. Oh, I cannot tell you how much better the audio is whenever your earphones are actually plugged in. <laughs> Random rag on the floor. My boost pack feels absolutely useless. I have lasers, came with, only found one laser weapon. It feels way better than any other weapon. Find anything useful? I have a lot of guns that I don't, I'm don't. i not going to pick up because I just don't have the carry capacity. Jesus, Sarah, stop that. You keep scaring me. <laughs> I don't think we're alone. We are absolutely not alone. We're currently stealing all their stuff. It's fine. There's a mine there. Don't stand on it, Sarah. She's like, don't worry about it. It's fine. Sarah is on jump scare farm. Feel like you need more weapon traits and it feels bad to require it. That's fair. Melee and another one? Woo. It might be better than my existing one. Let me see. Um, Higher energy resist. Better airborne. What does airborne mean? It doesn't look as good though. And it's quite significantly lower on the uh, physical resist scale. Sarah sworn to carry your burdens. You can load them up with gear. Yes, she doesn't say that though. And I was really hoping she would. Thank you to whoever just subbed or resub, by the way. Did you know it's currently September? That means you can get a new sub or upgrade your sub for 30% off. <laughs> I feel like I should know. I'm a bad streamer. Uh, no, that's the that was the armor that had the airborne trait. I'm not sure if it's like it allows you to be airborne for longer or what it means, but 25%. Thanks. I'm good at uh, making money as a streamer. I'm I'm really good at it. I don't know what you're talking here? about. You're my prime now, Psyche. 
Space Mum. Ah, Spike, thank you. I appreciate it. Welcome back. Happy three months. Have I looted all these already? Apparently, I have. I don't think I looted up top though. Did I get distracted here? Absolutely. Am I going to ever change that? No. Modified Grendel. Like, at this point, I don't... Like, I don't really care that they have uh, mods on them. Because I can't take the mods anyway. I am already over cucumbered. I can tell because my oxygen's going down even though I'm not sprinting. I think we did up here already. Yeah, running well over cucumber will drain your oxygen faster. Yeah, we did. Okay, I'm going inside. Ha! You take some of the mods, Kiki's core is weak AF. All right, what can I get rid of? What am I carrying that is so heavy? Um, My suit, but I'm wearing that. I mean, a, literally a lead lined pack. Um, this is also heavy, but I don't really want to... Oh, that looks so cool! That looks so cool. I don't want to get rid of it in case there's, like, a way to... Um, maybe I'll just drop these. Oh, it'll be a shame to leave that behind. Are you for real right now, Sarah? Hi, Aramar, how are you? I assumed it was a damage type in the resistance section, but there's nothing in the help. The only thing I could think was it would be an airborne attack would be like mushroom spores. Right, quick saving. Into the science facility. Look, I'm stealthy. She really is though. The thing is, she's like, don't pick up that junk. And then you pick up the junk and she's like, ugh. Then you drop an item and she's like, oh, it would be a shame to leave that behind. Zipper bandages. I don't know what that means. Oopsie! I need to not do that. Narsh, thank you for the sub. Welcome back. Happy 43 months. Sarah, why are you not wearing your armor? I feel like she should really wear her armor. Let's go in here. We'll loot after. Kaboom! <laughs> they jetpacked into the ceiling and died! <laughs> oh, there's more bad, pi bad people. I should probably take care of those before I loot, huh? Let's tear the whole place out. Here it out. A robot dog? Can I have one? I would like a robot dog. He's level 16. That is a mini boss. How do I get a robot dog? Ow, my health. Let's let's back off, Sarah. Is there a computer to disable the robot dog? That would be really nice. <gasps> a duck. My duck. Huh? I think they're upstairs. There's a bit in the equipment section of the game. Help. Airborne is a type of environmental damage, but doesn't give examples. Oh, okay. Interesting. I don't want to shoot the puppy. Does a robot count as a creature? It's a very existential question. I threw a grenade. Yes. I don't want to shoot the robot puppy, but I also don't want to die. Oh, the puppy is going to die because she's definitely 100% going to kill it. Is there a computer in here? Yeah, but it doesn't do anything. 
What if? Uh, uh. I think the puppy might be dead. <laughs> Why is he still grunting? Puppy, please. I want to keep it forever. Can I not keep it? Maybe I can go in here. Ah, oh, power required. I don't have a power cell. I want to see if I can steal it. Ooh, ah, I'm dying. Right, okay, puppy, don't mind me. Is there no way to turn it off? There really doesn't seem to be a way to turn it off! Ah! Robot puppy, you're going to have to die, and I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry, puppy, I'm so sorry. Sunny Tata! <laughs> Maybe I can learn how to make my own. Technically, I was going for endgame, but I will allow you all to decide sure for yourselves. We can use. There's someone else in there. Exterminator rec... Pirate rating pack? Zero G gimbal. This is the worst timeline. What is this? A science crate. Oh, I want one of these for my room. Sarah, can you carry some stuff yeah. for me? Have something for me? Yes. Oh, she's not carrying anything anymore. Excellent. Sarah, carry all of these. And, ooh, that's pretty nice. It's even nicer than mine. And it looks kind of cool. She can carry this one. And all of the helmets. Oh, this is actually not bad. Although mine looks really cool. Maybe you can get it back up after donning it. I don't think so. Sarah, please hold our booze, son. Capri, Capri, take our... <laughs> Take our Capri Sun vodkas. Um, you can carry these. And I have loads of weapons she can have. Um, the arc welder feels like it could be quite useful, but I'll let her carry it because I'm not using it right now. I have so many weapons. This is ridiculous. Sturm, hey! Seriously, more mugs. You need help. <laughs> I've stored way too many of them. There are so many on my ship, you would not believe. All right, that should be enough for me to continue looting. Bye for now. No problem. Let's go. All right, we're looking for a power cell to open a door. Excellent. But I got some looting to do first. I'm trying to remember I don't need literally everything. <gasps> Ooh! An epic laser rifle. An incendiary modified Equinox. Very cool. My sister in law brought us. Capri Sun bags for a vodka's at the beach. That's amazing! Yeah, heck it, I don't need to carry all this stuff, but I'm gonna. Laser cartridge and an Equinox. Oh, that's a weapon rack? I want a weapon rack on my ship. Alien bug. Of course we're taking the alien bug. I don't need another microscope. More pistols. Don't forget to meet Claire. Okay. Claire's not here right now. Need is a very subjective concept. You're right. Just chilling. Me and my pirate bros just chilling. <laughs> Alright, I think we're going upstairs. Can we take the video phone back there? I don't think so. Puppy, I'm sorry. Very cool puppy though. He's feeling cute. <laughs> Might delete letter. <laughs> what is in the science place? Holy moly, this is extensive. Bad people, bad jokes, three! Best books. A chunk's chunk walks into a bar. Bartender says we don't serve food here. Chunk sit down and says, then I guess I'm in the right place. <laughs> what? Knock, knock. Who's there? Broken sword. Broken sword who? Oh, never mind. It's pointless. Oh. I pressed the wrong button, but that also works. I meant this one. <laughs> How many atheists does it take to screw in a light bulb? None. They're already enlightened. What's the last thing to go through a Free Star Militia member's mind when they meet in the United Colonies Marine? A laser beam. Why don't terramorphs eat clowns? They taste funny. 
Unlike the first two volumes he published, Louis Looper's Bad People, Bad Jokes Volume 3 never really gained much of an audience. Popular theory suggests that by the time of its release, people were already tired of his terrible jokes. <laughs> they are pretty bad. Not gonna lie. Not exactly. A pen. Tissues. A notebook. Am I Looper? Maybe. Drink pack, whiskey. Chunks, cola? That's just a to-go cup. Oh, that scared the crap out of me. No! I could have updated the friend or foe! Activate it. Is it still alive? Be sure to carefully read the user manual before cha changing friend to foe settings for combat capable robots. Recalibrate. Protect current user. He wasn't a good boy. Is he alive? Maybe, maybe I didn't, maybe I didn't kill him. Maybe he is alive. I didn't have to kill him. I'd like a gold star for my reaction there. Set aside anything useful and just leave the rest. What are you trying to say? Why would the computer for that be in the fucking canteen? <laughs> Chips of the line cereal. Mmm. A mug! I don't need as many mugs or succulents as we have, but I'm keeping them anyway. I don't care. I used no, I don't need an empty coffee bag. Saturday and Sunday, I thought I took the red pill. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yes, hello. I am here. I am streaming today because I'm too excited for this game. Welcome back, Zippy. Happy 63 months. Thank you. Continues your favorite pastime of killing dogs. Wow. <laughs> Fisto's great, great, great grandchild. Hi, Temporal Flux. I'm really enjoying it. How are you? <sighs> I didn't want to kill him. Maybe there are more. Look, a sippy cup. Uh, I would like all of the things, please. I have so much heart plus and I never use it. Carry of the cosmos. Ooh, cred sticks. Chunks pie. Read this. I can't read it. This is such a troll. It's not actually possible to read that. That's such a troll. I don't need any chunks. A weapon workbench. What's in here? Prototype equipment. It's worth money. Penicillin X. Ship repair fundamentals. The real trick to spaceship repair is to focus on the immediate and pragmatic. To ask yourself, what can and should I be addressing right now to make my ship flight worthy? Space travel is exceptionally dangerous. We all know this, but focusing on that danger, obsessing over it helps no one. In fact, thinking about it too much, especially when faced with a malfunctioning ship, can be paralyzing. Just keep it simple and do whatever needs to be done, even if that means using scrap or salvage to keep yourself afloat. So begins Horace Jan's Ship Repair Fundamentals, the go-to book for spaceship repair throughout the settled systems. Imagine if you could bring a shopping trolley instead of a companion with your missions. <laughs> Having a chill morning for an everything day. Lots of errands. Oof. You haven't seen Starfield yet? I'm really enjoying it. I'm not very far into the story. We came here on a story mission and then I got distracted by... Yeah, what is it? Ma'am. Bye-bye. Um, I got distracted by a settlement that was off to one side, so I wanted to go explore it. Um, I keep picking up hazmat suits. They're really not worth it. Helium 3! I don't know if I need those. Use the weapon workbench to do something with those modded guns. You can take the mods off them, but you cannot put the mods back on, and it costs you materials to remove the mods. That is my only real criticism so far of gameplay. So if I show you what I mean, which one is it? This one? Yeah. I can take a gun and I can remove the mods that are on it. So, for example, it has a bunch of stuff on it. I can remove those, but I don't get the mod back. 
if you know what I mean. So like, let's see. This is a laser rifle that I might actually use. This little guy here, I would like to add mods onto it, but you have to craft the mods. You can add mods, you just have to craft them. So the materials are up here. So I could give it a compensator, which would increase stability and hip fire accuracy at the cost of long range accuracy, a muzzle brick to increase long range accuracy at the cost of hip fire accuracy, and a suppressor. Vastly reduces acoustic, uh, acoustic intensity while increasing accuracy at the cost of range. I might take this. Oh, I can't because I don't have any polymers. Can I craft one of these? I can't craft this because I don't have muzzle mods one. So, but I can't craft this, so fuck it. Confirm. Oh, that's a hell of a gun modification. She's so cute. Standard barrel. Long boy! Magazine and battery. I can give it a large magazine. Oh, that looks cool. White hot rounds. They lost the ability to put attachment rails on firearms. <laughs> Long boy, just like our ship. Been on a Horizon Zero Dawn kick recently. Oh, that's cool. Very different from what I remember of Elder Scrolls and Fallout. Ask gameplay, yeah. All I had to do was walk 10 feet across a room and tell Sarah I'm ready to go. Instead, I'm halfway across the city. Just bought a snazzy suit and I'm not breaking into an apartment. I did that mission too, Zilmar. The Imperium hasn't found the attachment rail STC yet. Nope, not yet. Do I have any lasers? I can't. I don't have any neon. So I'm happy with that, but I would like to modify my rifle, which I've forgotten what it's called. It is called... It's not that. Where is it? Oh, it's this one. Um, currently has a long barrel. So I could give it other stuff, but that would not necessarily help me. I'd like to give it an optic. I could give it a reflex sight, but I don't have any chlor chlorocyl sites or adhesives. So I'm going to track that and see if I can find some of those. Compensator was your stripper name. <laughs> I bet it was. Okay. So yeah, you can't remove a mod from a previous, a previously equipped weapon and then put it on. That's not how it works, unfortunately. Hi, Sarah. Hmm? Let's trade Bring gear. Me anything useful? All right. Um, I would like to give you these. And any weapons I've picked up that I'm not willing to carry. Two of those. Don't really need to have this favorited anymore because I'm currently using this baby. So, oh, but it's a laser rifle. So I might actually use this laser rifle instead. Um... I'm not using this anymore. So you can carry that. That gives me a little bit of breathing room. What's the point of removing them at all? Um, if you wanted to replace them with something else, I guess. Hmm. I did, Tem Portal. Bye. Bye. Uh, let me switch out which one of these I'm using. So... That one? Yeah. This can be my laser rifle. All right. Let's move the fac on. I think I've cleared everything in here. Because I think we're going down into that room now, which means there's probably more people to fight. Probably. There's definitely gonna be people here, right? No, wait, this is where I was. Isn't it? Wait a second. What's this? Huh? We have materials here that I haven't looted because I got distracted by comp- Regarding prump prump company property? Company property. Team, it has come to our attention that some of you may have programmed our robotic assets to perform inappropriate tasks. This is a clear violation of company policy. In no way should our robotics be used for fetching, brewing, or distributing coffee and should never be treated as personal servants. They may be robots, but they're still to be considered your teammates. Any lost time has been calculated and will be evenly deducted from everyone's pay. Thanks, HR. They were using the robots to make coffee. <laughs> Amazing. 
absolutely stunning behavior. The gravity paradigm. Truth is, what our scientists didn't know back then could fill volumes. The focus, of course, was on wormholes and not only creating, but maintaining a stable and sustainable Einstein-Rosen bridge. I think I've read this already. HR should be happy that that's all they were doing with them. Why is it HR's <laughs> job to deal with robots? True. Sword of Damocles, Shadows in the Attic. <sighs> okay. Chunks. Uh, how many heals do I have, actually? On that note, I have. I have four heal pastes, but I'm thinking more like med packs. I have nine. I need to learn how to make med packs. I killed a coffee-making puppy. I did. I'm a horrible person. I am a terrible, terrible person. That guy sitting there like that is killing me. I'm going back down here because I just want to double check that I didn't miss anything, but I don't think I did. I think this is going to take me outside, though. Yeah, I think this takes me outside. All right, pals. I haven't had a break yet, and I just realized. So I'm going to go to the bathroom real quick. Is I kind of need B. But let's go back to our ship first. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do... What's that? <gasps> There's a cave! Never mind, we're going to the cave. Actually, I should go back to the ship first. <gasps> should I, though? Nah, we're going that way. Hi, Obi-Wan! Any good bingo events? I'm sure someone will catch you up. I need to go to the toilet. I'll be back in a sec. It is not a snack break. <laughs> We knew you needed to pee yesterday. All right, BRB, I'll be back in a second. I will see you here. We will play. It'll be great. Go stretch. Go get a snack, get a drink, take your meds, unclench your jaw, relax your shoulders and stop sitting like a trip. <laughs> I thought I'd die a lot more than I have, to be fair. Uh, I have only died like three times and it was all on the super long stream. And uh, I'm pretty sure that it was all. Can I tag this? Don't rush the scan. Wouldn't want to overlook anything valuable. What? What do you mean? Girl, what are you talking about? So close to being able to get the Magi plushie. I really need to do some of the event. I probably will later. This is the wrong button. You can have a wrong button on the bingo card. Sarah! Why would you do that? <laughs> why? <laughs> That's the way she went, oof. <laughs> I'm like, girl. I'm sorry, but maybe don't run in front of people when they're using the laser. Why would you laser our wife like that? I'm calling the police. <laughs> it's way easier catching chapas now. There seems to be fewer people in on the chase. Really? Okay. Maybe people just kind of overdid it at the beginning. Hi, Karumba. I'm really enjoying it. Have you tried it yet? I'm really, really enjoying it. Uh, it's... It's a lot of fun. It's very much what I was looking for. Like not catching chappas and getting credit. Wait, was that happening? But if you don't catch anything, you don't you don't get any tokens anymore. You only get tokens for whatever you catch, right? Where'd that cave go? Where'd that cave go? Oh, it's here. <laughs> it's a grind and a half, it is. She did walk in front of my mining laser. There's a party goal. I see. You mean to tell me that I was carrying Solu the whole time? I'm kidding. <laughs> I was kidding. Not played it yet. I'm really enjoying it. It is very much what I was looking for in a game. Um, I always wanted a game that was 
spacey, but also, like, I don't just want to be in space. I want to be in a space-themed game. Like, I think a lot of people were looking for a game that was, like, literally just elite, but with RPG elements as well. And it doesn't play like that. It plays like an Elder Scrolls or a Fallout in space, which is exactly what I wanted, you know? Cave discovered. I want to go inside the cave and see what's inside. I bet you there's a beastie. Oh my goodness, it's dark in here. Oh my goodness, it's dark in here. What's this? Fluorine? All right, Sarah, do me a favor. I don't know if I can mine this with this. heal again because my health is low i wish i felt like eating food actually helped me but it does not is this just a like tiny little hole in the ground that has a thing in it My, disappoint my only disappointment so far is the amount of loading screens in terms of how segregated that makes everything. They're quick, so it's not an issue from a gameplay point of view, really, but it is a shame. I think... So, I don't know, because I'm not a game developer, so I can't really say, but part of me feels like for a game to be as vast as what would be ideal and, like, open and whatever, I feel like it would be really tricky. I thought that was a spider. I truly thought that was a spider. That's where we came in. Okay. I don't think there's anything in here. Maybe I'm wrong. I, I think this might just be a cave with a random, like, thing in it. Disappointing. I was hoping there'd be a beastie. I thought there'd be a beastie. Oh, what's this? A rock pile. Oh, it has stuff in it. Oh, I can harvest like that. Okay, I see, I see, I see. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in here. Okay, well, out we go. Sip, I can take a sip. Talwin, how you doing? Happy Saturday, folks. I know this is not a usual stream day for me, but I just really want to play the game. How are you? Nice to meet you. Welcome on in. Right, I think we're going back to the ship now. So... Can I... Can I place an outpost? I'm not trying to place an outpost. I didn't know I could do that. Do you know what? Uh, that's the cave. Let's go here. There we go. You feeling cute and silly? Hell yeah. We love feeling cute and silly. Right, I'd like to deposit some of my stuff. Constantly load unload resources as you're getting closer to them and require more detail. Probably a dumb idea, but I'm also not a developer. That's how it goes, though. I have so much fashion. You can have fashion if you want fashion on your bingo card. More power wash simulator. Uh, what am I wearing? I'm wearing this. <laughs> the utility headphone cap. Have you met Cupid? Uh, I, mm? <laughs> I was going to make a joke. That is, in fact, where my name came from, though, is the story of Psyche and Eros. Um, that is a better helmet. But this has minus 15% incoming. Yeah, no. Okay, hang on. Can I equip it? Yes. Put that away. I'm just trying to get all of my stuff. I've run out of space. 
Time to get more cargo. Well, we're going back to the lodge anyway, so. Potential spoilers, spoilers? Story spoilers is what I was trying to say. You're more than welcome to tell a Greek mythological joke. I'm not sure everybody will get it, but. Lift off looks good. Let's go. I need to upgrade this ship. I want to hear the answer. I don't know. Who? Everybody! Skyscrapers can't jump! <laughs> Did you hear that? Okay. Good one, Cora. Wait, is that a traitor? Ship needs more neck. Is that a traitor? Hey. Hey. Are you a traitor? Can I? Ooh. Hello? I'll trade anything and everything. Yay! Got market value. We'll haul it. She's adorable. Oh, let's trade. I got some cargo that could use a good home. Is that our kidnapped child? Yes. Right. Uh, do you have any? Not ammo. I actually would really like some. Oh, this is the same guy I sold my stuff to already. Okay, that's fine. He has five thousand credits. All right. I'm going to sell from ship inventory. I don't need to carry these around. I did not literally steal a child. Medic, you see, this is what happens. No, I brought Sam on my ship and he brought his child with him. <laughs> I didn't kidnap a child. Queen, unfortunately, I'm afraid I do not get that joke. Are the cops where? It's Sam's literal child. I like that Oath was willing to believe you would. Oath says that I kill dogs because the wolves attacked me in Skyrim. Uh, I might keep that. And I might keep that because it was the first ever nice item I got. Um, sell from ship inventory. Uh, spacesuits. No, I want to keep that. Um, packs. I'm going to keep the chameleon one and the constellation one. And then I think I'm going to get rid of these. That one's really nice, though. I, I guess I just, Queen, I just don't speak Spanish. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Who is to say she isn't above taking the children too? Look, I, okay. <laughs> um, Can I sell? I'm selling all my normal shit. I already have this. I think I'm going to just sell that one as well. And I'm going to sell that. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, miscellaneous stuff. You can have another one of these and another one of these. I'm keeping the alien bug paperweights though. Because they're actually I'll sell the stolen one. I'll keep the one that's not stolen. Everything else is upload Google Translate. <laughs> Circuit boards allegedly are not actually things I can use. I'm keeping. We put the S in mast. What does that mean? <laughs> Medic. What does that mean? What does that mean? Um, cube, a deck of cards. I have 10 digi picks, some hooker canisters, five packs of cigarettes, three packs of smokes, which are somehow different. I am keeping the plushie, prototype equipment, and a wooden duck that I'm keeping because it's cool. I've decided. Um, what else do I have that I can get rid of? I'm keeping these. These are my outfits. These are my fashion. Um, I'm selling some food, I think. Oh, it's plus 802 for five minutes. 
I thought it was plus 802 for five meters. And I was like, that's not a lot. That's not a lot. That's like a step and a bit. <laughs> I was so confused. That makes more sense. It could be a lot for small legs. That's true. Uh, amp. Right, so which of these, is, what, what's the weight of these? Okay, I think, oh, that gives you extra carry capacity. That could come in handy. I'll store, I'll sell my bacon and my beer. <laughs> I'm just a girl. I don't know what time is. I don't know what time is. I don't know what time or distance is. Watermelons! They don't do anything for me. Bourbon. Plus six carry capacity for five minutes, minus 25% O2 recovery for five minutes. That seems decidedly bad. Why is it whenever you drink bourbon, you become less good at breathing? <laughs> That's the second? What one? What did you have? What did I do? Oh, just a girl. Fuck! Are you incorrect? About what? Tune into the watermelon. I thought it was an actual planet till you switched item. <laughs> I'm sorry! <laughs> also, last night... Uh, T was petting Az and I asked Az a question. T said, he's just a girl. How do you expect him to know that? <laughs> Drink pack water. That's pretty nice, actually. Drink pack whiskey. Bad. Uh, nope. Anything that just restores health is getting sold because, um, useless. I can't. It's completely useless. I'm not. I'm selling the booze. I have alien DNA. Two health is not enough. Hi, Grumbly. Milk stout. I'm never selling the bread. I'm just selling him all this random food. Steak, veal, a tranquility. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Sino, thank you for the biddies. I appreciate it. Thank you. How are you? Are you playing this? Chunks Cola, a cube of synthetic cola. I have questions. Why is the cola hard? Why does your cola have edges and corners? Why is your cola chewy? Because <laughs> it's all the salad dressing. Yes, Raven, except he never does that. <laughs> Are you sure it's not an OXO cube? Oh my God, imagine if they were just eating a stock cube. <laughs> that was me, Queen, in this uh, settlement that we were just at. Chunks pie, a pumpkin pie flavored chunks food cube. Oh my God, it's ready for pumpkin spice season. Chunks potato, packaged. I'm just getting rid of anything. Oh, that, actually the cola would have been good. One health from eating an entire orange. Chocolate bites. Uh, I'm keeping any meds. Heal paste, heart, Hippo, hippolyta, hippo, I don't know. Immobilizer, penicillin, X. High intensity antibiotic. Don't talk to me before I've had my PSL. <laughs> uh, recon stim ref refines muscular control and flexibility. Oh, it reduces movement noise. That's pretty cool. I knew taking a Doring fan was a mistake, but hey, another pack mule. <laughs> was it bad? Is it bad? I specifically didn't take him because he was so annoying. All right, I need more med packs. Does he have any med packs actually? Can I buy med packs? Do you have any med packs? He has some snake oil. <laughs> he has 12 for 5k. All right, go on then. Can't put a price on health. Um, and then can I sell my anything else that I have that would help me with my constant inability to have space? No, okay, I think I'm good. Actually, can you stay there? Stay right there, sir. Oh shit. No, it's gonna do that thing where I hail him again. Can I on target? How do you on target? Like, I'm looking at something else and pressing E, but nothing happens. I'd like to get out of my seat.
I'd like to get out of my seat, but if I hold E, I will hail him. And I would like to... I tried targeting an empty space. It doesn't do anything. Oh, now it's doing something. What the heck? I spammed it so many times. You'd like to use your hot task? I honestly cannot see, for me, any time I would ever use my hot task in this game. Can I have your stuff so I can sell it? Oh my God, Alt F4? You're right. I'll only carry the good stuff. <laughs> Just kidding. She's cute. I like her. Um, give me your stuff so I can sell it. Uh, you can keep the good the good arc welder. Um, actually, can you? I don't know if I really want to keep it. Uh, maybe I will. I'll keep it and we'll sell everything else. Um, she's apparently got that equipped. I wish I could tell her what. Oh, wait, I can tell her what to equip. That's pretty nice. Um, sell these and actually let's trade gear. If you have gear. any gear you want me to haul. As long as you're not just giving me stuff you don't want. <laughs> um, she has resources. I'm going to take all her. Oh no, I took all her items again, didn't I? No, I didn't. Okay, we're good. You're amazing. Has anyone Time ever told to you how amazing you are? Do you crew members have specific tasks to be assigned? You can assign, um, like, up space on your ship for them, and then they give you bonuses depending on what skills they have. You love Saturday morning with me? Thanks. I'm having a good time. Hi, can I sell I'll more crap to you? And everything, my friend. If it's got market value, we'll haul it. Thanks. I'd appreciate that. Let's trade. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? I, it's like he's forgotten I was just here. Um, sell. And it's all from my inventory. So you can take this, this, this. If it's not equipped, I don't need it. I have favorited everything that I'm going to be using. Making some cash now, hey? Making back that money that I spent on his stuff. And then... Uh, ammo's fine. Spacesuits, I'm good. And then I have the resources. I'll put those away. Yep, that works. I think I can just put the resources away. <laughs> Why didn't you say so? Please on target him. There we go. Nope. Wait, mission? Oh, that's mission to go somewhere. I see. You missed Saturday morning with Psyche. I'm sorry. Okay. Transfer. Um, it's almost full, unfortunately, but it's mostly with uh, resources. So I'm hoping I can like put that somewhere. The container is at max capacity. Yeah, we need to get more uh, cargo space. Let's do that when we go back. I also need to upgrade my ship a little bit. I think I'm going to have to rebuild the whole thing. What are we spending our cash on? I honestly could not tell you. Mission. Beep, 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 boop, boop, boop. Off we go. All neck. Only neck. <laughs> mm. Good luck, Temporal. Have a good day. I accidentally sold all my digipics and didn't realize until I closed and reopened the game. Oh, no. I sold my contraband. Bono <laughs> sign clips. You could have at least picked Liam Neeson. Scan complete. You are cleared to land at New Atlantis. Okay, cool. Thank you. I will do that right now. To the lodge. Really want to level up again. I hope you're all having a lovely day. I'm having a lovely day. Let's pop into Outland while we're here. <laughs> He's and see too if Joe beautiful. Has anything useful to add to our arsenal. <laughs> that was creepy. She was talking, but her mouth wasn't moving. Um. Where did she want to go? Whatever. I can store some stuff in this room as well. Some cats got some pets. Good to be I've home. been petting them all day. Saturday morning Starfield stream. Telepathy. Do you have my stuff? At your service, Captain. Got a little held up on Vectera. Uh huh. Barry, you were worried sick. Well, some of us were. Some of us were. I apparently. see what you did there, Walter. And I know you've been secretly crying into your piles of money just waiting for my return. <laughs> Actually, Walter.
Walter has been complaining about I see his ventriloquism. Usual, which is always a sign he's working. Don't start, country. Wait, is that? <laughs> I hope you are satisfied the with the orders available to you. Just on the library show. Now look at them all. You feel it a bit, can't you? Yeah. Ever since I found the second one, I had the visions. Being around them is just comforting. Comforting. Just catch me but wrapping hey, myself I'm around still them. Not a hundred percent. Plus, I feel guilty dragging you into all of this. Why don't I stick around? Help you get adjusted to the weird corners of the universe. You could, I mean, if you're coming with me, who's in charge of the frontier? It doesn't really matter to me. We never get too attached to ships. He's just like, whatever. After the fifth or sixth time one blows up and you get Yes, Obi-Wan. The romance fades. Plus, the frontier is a constellation ship. And you're one of us now. So it's just as much yours Good thing, as too, because I've modified it. Traveling together sounds good to me. Does this replace Sarah? Marvelous. Barrett is available to be your companion. All right, cool. Level up. Ding, ding, ding. Okay. So I have got this. This is now available. I've also got this. I think I'll take rank three. So ballistic weapons now do 30% more damage. I also can start thinking about unlocking these. We have demolitions, heavy weapons, incapacitation. EM weapons are generally employed to damage robots, but can also be used to render human beings unconscious. Oh, uh, yeah, unlocked them. Never going to use them. <laughs> Particle beams. And I want this. I want this. I want rifle certification very badly. Um, and then we have marksmanship, rapid reloading, sniper certification and targeting, armor penetration, crippling and sharpshooting. Then we have, I haven't taken anything in science. I would really like to take some stuff in science. And we have a bunch of stuff in tech. I need to destroy more ships. Ooh, I can take this now. Using a boost pack expands less fuel. Okay. I need to level up more. What's this? Constellation guide. Permanently reduces fall damage by 5%. Excellent. As much as I love uncovering new questions, I wouldn't mind a few answers now and then. That is fair. Vasco, can you come you on my are ship? satisfied with the quarters available to you, Captain. Now that you are a member of Constellation, I am at your service. Please join my no ship. No additional protocols necessary. Also, given the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space, it might be beneficial to go over exploration yes, yes, outpost yes. development. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. In case you ever need to build a base for yes, field yes, yes. research. There was a mod to give Vasco a new skin. I'm concerned. I post development, what do you mean? The exploration of an unknown planet can be a major undertaking. By building an outpost, you will be able to construct scanning equipment, resource extractors, and defenses. Base building. It is even possible to set cute. up multiple outposts capable of manufacturing, allowing you to build advanced equipment. I'm so excited. We're just going to have an entire stream of building a base. Um, how do I know if a planet has the resources I need? A planetary scan will reveal the presence of key inorganic resources, although rarer elements will be harder to find without training. I'm so and excited. While a scan may detect the presence of Base life time. on a planet, you will have to analyze the native plants and animals yourself to know what compounds they produce. You can set uh, always run. You can turn it off temporarily. So I have a button, the button by default on keyboard is caps lock. So if you press caps lock, you'll start walking. And then if you press caps lock, you'll, you'll start running. What kind of advanced structures can I build? The scan booster is the most obvious as it will enable you to cool. detect landmarks no problem. and other points of interest from further away. Beyond that, extractors will allow you to collect raw materials of various types, while fabricators enable the manufacturing. Excellent. A particularly prosperous outpost may even warrant the construction of cargo links, allowing you <gasps> to share resources That's between so good. other outposts you have built. That's so good. Uh, sounds useful. The blueprints you need to construct an outpost should already be on your watch. 
It That's will cool. automatically connect to any available materials for Thanks. construction in your ship's cargo. Back for that. I can use you on my crew. Do you miss Barrett? He's right here. Captain, I will proceed to my assigned post. Okay, so crew from any location can be assigned to a landed ship. No assignments are currently available. That's fine. As long as he's on my ship, I don't care. Um, so she's assigned for astrodynamics and uh, her... Actually, is she assigned? I would like him to be assigned to my ship. He's on assigned as well. Assignment, the lodge. Uh, he does outpost engineering. She does outpost management. Can I just... On assigned from Frontier. And then... Assign Vasco. There we go. So he has shield systems and EM weapon systems. So you can give him like a specific assignment. Um, so he's on the ship. Wait, can hang on. That's fine. So I can't assign them because there's not enough space, I think. Barrett has gastronomy. He can make us snacks. That's some good stuff. Starship engineering, particle beam weapon systems, and robotics. That is pretty cool. Unassigned to the lodge. So I cannot assign him to the ship because I think my ship is full. So these are on my ship. I kind of want to unassign um, Lynn for now and then assign Barrett because of like all of this stuff and then come back for them. You've not got to a crew menu yet. I got it whenever I got my first non-Sarah companion. All right, cool. I'm going to go and see if I can modify my ship a little bit. Sandwich time. What kind of sandwich? Or do you mean he's going to make me a sandwich? <laughs> Stellar gastronomy skills making a meal of sky pictures. <laughs> um, I would like to fast travel to my ship. I have met Walter. All right, I want to go and modify my ship. Hold on. I want to see if we can get some more cargo space. Perhaps both. So the child is his child. Who just got off my ship? I have something for you. Been keeping busy. Oh, Lynn's getting off my ship. Okay, hang on. Let's see. What are you doing? Hey, Just chilling. Kind of breaking my concentration here. What are you concentrating you on? Hiya. Oh, Anything I can help you with? Um, I would like to view and modify my ships. Sure. How about it? So here we go. Um, ship builder. So here's my ship so far. I do want to give it um some more cargo. I am tempted. I wish you could like rotate this up at an angle. It'd be kind of cool. Who's the voice actor for Walter? I haven't spoken to him. He's just sitting over there. Who is it? I would like to add additional cargo space. Habs. What are Habs actually for? Okay, they're just kind of like a companion or like a not companion, an extra duda. Fuel tanks, engines, dockers, cockpits, cargo, cargo. <gasps> oh, that's cool. All right, so we have extra space that we could put in. These are 225, these are 210. How big are these? So can they, they cannot attach to this. Oh wait, they can attach to underneath. Okay. So we can put this to here. Eh, how do I, eh, eh. It's gonna be right in front of my face though. So maybe not. Um, these attach to the side though. So. How do I move it? Options. Undo, redo. No, I don't. Oh, I have to drag and drop. So I can add that. And then can I duplicate this? And then flip it and attach that on there. 
And then I have an error. Flight check. Low mobility, ship's too heavy to grab jump, reduce mass, or increase grab jump thrust. Okay, how about we go to... Um... I think I might need to modify. That's not what I wanted. Um... Grav drives. Where does it fit? Oh, I could put one on here. Does it actually help? <laughs> that seems like an odd place to put a grav drive. I already have one of these at the back, but what if I just add another one? Two errors. Only one grav drive is allowed. Okay. So what if we replace the grav drive then that we have? So this is the grav drive here. What other grav drives do we have? What is this one? This one is an NG-160. There's a mod to replace paintings in game with a picture of Todd. <laughs> are we space pirate captain? We are. NG-160. What about the 170 instead? The Helios. Um, so what are, what is what are the stats of this? Um, this is an A-class, max power 8, 13 jump thrust, 52 drive health, hull 5. So, max power, uh, maybe, hmm, how much do I need? Does it tell me? Like if I, if I move this, edit, if I put this over here, what if I then replace that with the 170? I can always put it back, right? One warning. Does this mean I'm less mobile? Do tell. Yes. Reduce mass or add engines. Now, I don't think there's anywhere for me to put engines. Don't forget your 5e fuel scoop. I don't think there's anywhere for me to put engines now on this current build. So... I can put one here. That feels like it would be a bad move, though. <laughs> don't you think? Having an engine just, you know, hanging out there. There are no other connection points though. So I wonder if I if I need to like build up or something. Do you know what I mean? It's gonna take so much longer. So which are these? These are White Dwarf 2010. To 2010. So what? I have the best ones of these available. These are engine thrust 11,340, maneuvering thrust. The maneuvering thrust is the problem. 2,130. These are better. What do they look like? Whoa, chunky. Okay. How much do they cost? 9,000 each. Well, what if I got rid of these two? Hear me out. What if I uh, got rid of these two, put them over here for now. and put, oops, cancel, uh, back, um, and put these on the back. Why are they, oh, is that too high up? Why are they wonky? <laughs> what am I doing wrong? Why are they wonky? Why can that one connect higher up? What do you mean? Why? Why? <laughs> why are there two? Why are they? What? They're the same though. Aren't they? Yeah, they are. Why can I not move it up? Can, how do you move up? Ah, there we go. Why did that one connect higher than the other one for some reason? That's just weird. Okay, it's fine. So now I have three errors and I think two of them are this. So if we get rid of these. Hi, Kriana. I still have two errors. What are my errors? Need more grav jump. Ugh. Uh, ship reactor class. Ship contains modules that exceed reactor mass. This is so expensive. <laughs> um, all for cargo? Are you kidding me? That seems incorrect. So where's my reactor? Reactors. Where the 
fluff is my reactor. I have a coiling. Hab module. Docker. I feel like the reactor would be like in here. Yeah, there we go. Why are they wonky? <laughs> have you considered just buying a freighter? Look. Uh, so this is power generated 14. <sighs> I need something better than that. So which one is that? I don't know. 14, 16. How much do I need? I don't know how much I need. I have 22 equip. What? This is confusing. Is it because if I added an extra one? Reactor 14, I need 22. So I need an extra eight is what you're telling me. So none of these are going to work. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, this is just not. I feel like this ship is just not going to work. I need more cargo space, though. Cat whisper when he demands up now. I love it. I feel like I might need to replace. I might need to replace something else. So our grav drive is apparently too aggressive. Which module is it? What is the class A? Uh, is it this or is it these? No, it's these, right? Don't forget, you also need an even more powerful grav drive, which will need even more power. I got a more powerful grav drive. It's still not good enough. <laughs> so yes, I do need another more powerful. The engines were class B. So how do you tell what reactors required for that? Where does it say? Do they have to be... Do you have to have a class? That doesn't make sense. Either way, I can't afford this. So I think I'm going to have to accept that uh, this is not happening as it is. So hold on. Let me cancel my modification. Can I just buy a new ship? Uh, I'd like to see what ships you have for I'm sale. I'm sure you can find something you like. Just like me playing Elite for the first time. Um, okay. The Rambler. How much cargo capacity you got? What do you mean uh, 0 0.5? The Galileo. I'm not gonna be able to afford any of these. Why has it got this selected? Hang on, it's selected a weapon. I'm sure you can find something you like. There we go. Um, cargo capacity. 260, that's worse. 200, that's also worse. 2,660. The Econo Hall. Look at those fucking cargo. Look at those cargo containers on the side. It's actually not bad looking as well. Um, that is 94,975. I have 32,000. The Responder. Kind of neat looking actually. The sparrow. Sparrow is uh, not especially good looking, but it does have higher cargo capacity than my ship. That one looks really cool. I really like it. It's got good cargo capacity. It's got good everything. It's 279,000 credits. Do you think if I looked on the back of the sofa, I'd find enough money? Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to afford that. It's three ships held together with duct tape. Uh, vendor credits are how much money they have. Uh, 5,000 here. So can I sell from my ship inventory? It has a bunch of stuff. Many of them are resources. And my big problem is I actually just don't have space for all the stuff that I'm carrying. So I keep that. Getting rid of anything I don't like the look of. Um, that I'm probably never going to wear. I want my hat. I'm keeping my hat. 
How much is your ship worth? You can only fly one at a time. It's technically not mine. The looter's lugger. I feel like I shouldn't sell a ship that does not belong to me. Right, what else have we got to sell from the inventory to get rid of it? Keep the keep the broken space helmet. Um get rid of that. Keep that, because it's constellation. Uh get rid of that. Get rid of that. Oops. I wanna sell from ship inventory. No! I keep <laughs> I keep pressing the wrong button. Um, okay. Anything else in there? I've got some weapons, but I kind of want to keep those. I've got some of these, but I kind of want to keep them. Really, it does come down to the fact that I have just far too much of my resources, I think. Because look, some of these are really flipping heavy, but they're used for stuff. Gonna need to steal and sell a ship or two. I think I am gonna have to steal and sell a ship or two. How do you target? I'm not selling Vasco. How do you target uh, sub targets on a ship? Because I haven't seen that yet. No, I'm not selling the succulents. I refuse. They are my friends. They are my friends. Okay, let's go and do the next step anyway. So, oh, I wanted to do this because it does actually pay really well, I think. I want to complete the survey and we could probably build a, an outpost thingy. Although I need, I think I need a skill to do that. Need a perk. Heck. Actually, why are you with me? I don't want to bring you. <laughs> Do some smash or pass on the succulents. They're all smash because they're all beautiful. All right, let's go back yes. to Aridony. Hi, Sarah. I'm going to go scan some stuff and try and finish the planet because it actually paid really well. If I remember correctly, it was one of the missions that gives like... 14k. The sucks day. I'm pretty sure I saw the cockpit wobble there a little bit. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it wobbled a little bit. I'm actually glad you didn't get the perk that gave you a home, but you had to pay off the 125,000 credit mortgage. Yes. Stabilizing. Done. What's he doing? I feel like he's up to mischief. He's up to mischief for sure. Right, let's see. We are going to Eridini. We've already been here. We've This is where we died. This is the only time I've died so far was trying to survey this fucking planet. Let's land not there. Let's land. I landed just randomly here. <laughs> uh, let's land, I don't know, like here. Why not? How many times you died so far? Well, I I did die like three times there. <laughs> oh, it's cool looking. All right, let's go. We are going to find the last things we need. You've gained an affliction. I got poisoned. I don't recommend. You tried to land in an ocean. I don't believe landing in an ocean is possible. Captain, greetings. I don't want Barrett. He's very want... funny, but he's an asshole. You got corrosive burns. Find something you need. Ready to head back out? I'm glad you're back. Let's get moving. Okay, let's go. Sarah. Ugh. Sarah. Good to see you again, my dear friend. I expect to hear some exciting tales when you two return. I'll try, but I doubt any of them will compare to the spectacular tales that we hear <laughs> you spin. All right, let's go. Sure. I've got a minute. Barrett is like really determined to talk to me. Vasco's just gonna chill here. Okay, what's our situation? We got more balloon boys. Have I actually finished scanning those? I have no idea. Oh, look how cool that looks. Is 
this a bindy hunter? Is that a bindy hunter? Has a bindy hunter just come here to try and mess me up? Mage, thank you for the biddies. Came to give me a free ship? Well, let's find out. First of all, though, have I, I have not scanned all of these. Why do you have a bounty? I started as a wanted person. You can select traits when you start. And I started with Alien DNA, uh, Free Star Collective, and Wanted. And Wanted gets you. Oh, those are going to be a problem. Those are level 25? Why am I surrounded by ships that are landing here in the middle of nowhere? What's this? Sweet fume wart. So, what have we got? Animal, vegetable, or mineral? Actually, I actually have no idea what that is, but it has sealant seeds. It's because of what you did. <laughs> They've come to give you credits. Excellent. I need to finish scanning the balloon boys, but I'd really like to know why there are people landing near me in the middle of nowhere. Did I already scan this precise balloon? I think I did. Is that another ship coming down or leaving? We're at 60% nearly. We did get to like 68% and then I died and then I decided to give this a, a bit of a break because I was just getting fucked up okay it's only level 10 maybe it's not aggro to me i'm pretty sure they are pretty sure they are they heard there's an easy target here well look i've messed up every other bounty hunter that's come towards me so does that one that one looks like it has a disease of some sort because they have like a special look that one doesn't. Up at the top it says uh, Scepter whatever. Now it says Sarah because she's standing in front of me. Could you not? That one has like a little like biological icon next to it. I think it might be dead. Or dead? Diseased. Is that a different one? That is a different one, but there's no way I'm going after a level 25. Absolutely not. Maybe they're throwing you a surprise party. Not the surprise party. What the heck? A dune tangle? Oh, these are different. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I have another one of these. Sealant. Delightful. We landed at the polar ice cap last time, which was kind of cool. defaults to hangry well i mean i default to hangry and i'm not pregnant <laughs> there's also a thing here should probably not get too close to them vents hey oh a party cool <laughs> spiny bell cactus what are you boopity booping june tangle Hmm, another one of these. Cosmetic flower. Oh, cute. Not unless you want to join me in the burns ward. Maybe not. Is it dead? I don't think it is. Nope. That's a level 25. Run for your life. Run for your life, Sarah. Run for your life. I cannot. Oh, no. Oh, he's really close to dead, actually. I'm gonna finish him off. Sorry, but also I'm not really. 25% scanned, toxin tissue. Easy. <laughs> nice that you don't have to travel two kilometers for di genetic diversity. Yeah, true. Rip that guy. <laughs> These look like alien eggs. Am I wrong? They kind of look like xenomorph eggs. 
Vanadium. Vanadium or vanadium? I kind of like that I'm just kind of left to my own devices. Do you know what I mean? HR gear. They do. <gasps> Sis. Water! Neat. She's just wandering around here without her helmet on. You telling me that this is safe? Depends on who complains about how you say it, then it's the opposite of what they want. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I am the most otherwise person. 88%? Um, well, it depends on your companion you took everywhere with you in Skyrim. But yes, they do actually just kind of work like Space Lydia. Hundred percent nice. Self cloning. Neat. I she did also jump through my mining light laser, that's true. that dog is how I died last time so oh I've already done that silly me sandy desert can we take it on the ship uh only if we kill it I think but you can actually domesticate so I would like to figure out how to do that also whoever that was who did a little cheeky sub there thank you I scan all of those. I don't want to build an outpost, but I don't really know to what degree I necessarily want to stay on this planet, if you know what I mean. It's not exactly a nice planet. Wonder where one would find adhesive. I've already done these. I can harvest it. This planet is not very nice. That's a rock. And it has weird spider dudes. Spider dudes. Spider dudes. Humanity made new earth in this solar system? You mean here? Scan any promising leads. I don't think here counts. There's nobody here. Right. Literal space bug. That's true. That was a literal space bug. Well, we're not exactly nice people. I have been very nice. What are you talking about? Uh oh. Something's aggro. Oh, it's that. Oh, Sarah, we do not want to get caught up in nature. <laughs> There's another one. Bloody hell. Radioactive gas. Oh. I do need to actually check this one out, so... Uh-oh. Aliens! I do need to scan it. For science, of course, you understand. Temperamental fearless. She's fearless. Nature's scary. The ideal planet needs a water ocean and no more than an atmosphere with 21% of it comprised of oxygen. <gasps> no, look, it's our little bug friend. Peaceful. Oh, I love him. Look at him. Are you still there? Mental case, thank you for the resub. Happy seven months. Aw, I love him. I will call him George. His name is George. Time to leave a breadcrumb trail. Haha, <laughs> joke's on you. You can fast travel to your ship. <laughs> Oxygen's overrated. Whoa! Don't want to 
fight him. Don't want to fight him. Run for your life. Maybe he'll get distracted and attack something else. <gasps> Hi, George. George is adorable and I love him. Why is this red? Does this mean there's somebody here? Is there a George? It keeps going red like I'm hovering over something. Is there a George in the grass? There may, in fact, be a George in the grass. What that? Ship landing site. Is that my previous ship landing site? Meant to trap the bug on our ship. We talking kidnapping native species under our ship? <laughs> they like the bread, right? <laughs> I see what you mean. Ah, <laughs> uh, they might. Like an apple? Ooh, apple lungs. I hate that. <laughs> What's our situation here? We are on three of five flora and one of six fauna. I do need to scan the balloons because I've been seeing them for a while and I haven't finished scanning them yet. <sighs> I'm not going to be able to scan. They're really aggressive guys, though. Oh, they are really high up there, hey? Anyway, they're like... No, can't zoom in on those. There's somebody aggro over here. Is it that guy? It is that guy. Bloody hell. I'm gonna get lost. I need to finish scanning this planet though. Hi. No, don't worry about me. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm only attacking the aggressive things when they attack me first. Spiny bell cactus. Delightful. I just really need money. Is what I'm trying to say. Look at them flocking to that thing to kill it. Nature's cool. <gasps> Hello! I love this little guy. I wonder if it's possible for me to kidnap, <laughs> sorry, adopt the little guys that are sick and then give them treatment. That would be nice this plutonium yeah they're kind of like trilobites i wonder if i could give them treatment for whatever bacterial infection it is they have i'm gonna loot everything but yeah i have to say i've been very impressed with the performance um it feels good it feels good I haven't had any crashes. Speaking of, I should probably quick save in case I did have a crash because that would suck. Um, I haven't had any crashes, haven't had any bugs, except for the trilobites that we just find. You remember when you tried to kidnap the little guy in Subnautica Below Zero? I have no idea what you're talking about. I definitely didn't try to steal, steal a pangling and have its mother chase me. That didn't happen. <laughs> what quality on Ultra? The only thing is I turned off FSR 2 and I was expecting that to actually make it perform worse and I noticed absolutely no performance difference whatsoever. <laughs> Couldn't tell you what my FPS is because um, I'm using the Microsoft Store and I refuse... Oh, floating rock, floating rock! Um, I refuse to use game bar or whatever the fuck. Oh, those are only level five. Oh, no, wait, it has a mummy. Never mind. Location discovered. Ship landing site. Was this where I landed before or is it something else? What does that mean? It's been super smooth view running on high in 4K. The FPS is 69. You're probably right. It is a lot better than it used to be. I just don't want to use it. But I have heard it has improved a lot. These have been eaten. I will take their stuff. Why was that one carrying titanium? A bit weird. Where are we at? Where are the balloons? I thought you were throwing me a surprise party. Where are my balloons? Oh yeah, I also should say I'm on 1440p. But yeah, it feels good to me. Looks good to me. Haven't had any crashes, haven't had any real hitching or stuttering. Although I do know that there are people who have a computer that 
should be able to run it just fine and have been having some performance issues. Um, I'm not really sure what causes that exactly. I have heard that they are aware. Does that actually count as anything to scan? I don't think so. I'm at 70% completed. I really want to finish this and get my payout. Have I scanned that already? Yeah, I have. Who, the cops? What are they going to do, arrest me? <laughs> I know what you're trying to get me to say. Spooky Cthulhu trees. 100% scanned. So this gives you genetics, reproduction, self-cloning as well. <laughs> Busted. Everyone's trying so hard to get me to say certain things. It's so funny to me. T came in here and said, I'm going to need you to die so that I can complete my bingo. Actually, what he actually said was <laughs> he came in here and he said, um, excuse me, what does free square in a bingo mean? And I said, it means that it's a free square, so you get it for free. But in my case, I've made it to death because I expect to die. So if I die, you get it, but it's effectively a free square. And he was like, well, then it's not free. <laughs> you gonna give me a ticket? You gotta catch me first. I am their queen. I am their queen. T isn't wrong though. Uh oh. I might be their queen too. Can I scan you? What if I got really close and then climbed on that rock again? Stupid creature! Foo <laughs> Foo Sailor Spiders. <laughs> he ran away, it's fine. I'm good. No! Sarah! Sarah! <laughs> we were fine! Why? Sarah, why? Sarah, why would you do this? Why would Sarah do this to us? I helped you. I am your queen. <sighs> Sarah, Jesus fucking Christ, the aggression. Get companioned on, literally. All right, we only need one more of those balloons, I think. Why did you kill your subject? Ask Sarah. Sarah said science. Fuck science. <laughs> Are we have to kill the witnesses. Luckily, this gun is a badass, so... I need to scan that one as well. The hunted Vivuzel. I thought that showing its butt to Sarah would save it. True. Go scorched earth. Just the whole thing. Kill them all. Uh-oh. That's a level 25. I mean, to be fair, I did just kill a level 25 and it was fine. This gun is pretty nice, but... 50% scanned, right? Well, if I can get away with not killing them, I'd rather do that. But Sarah really said, hey, look, an enemy. I know. I'll shoot it. <sighs> the aggression. Ben, have you played yet? Sorry, when are you starting your playthrough? Tomorrow. Nice. She's seen your banger coin. She's doing you a solid. Wow. Monday. Hell yeah. I'm excited. Are we going to get a resurgence of Hide the Pain Harold? <laughs> For anyone who doesn't know, Sodu's character in uh, Mass Effect Andromeda looks like Hide the Pain Harold. Need to wait until after the semester ends or I'll get no actual work done. That is totally fair. Hello, little friend. Resource, nutrient. Well, I'm not harvesting him. I love these. These little guys are the best. Oh, that one's eating. Sarah! Why would Sarah do this to me? Oh, what the fuck is that? The music's great whenever you get into combat. I need to scan this thing though. 13% scan. Oh, God. I get real life Homer instead. No! 
<laughs> Not real life, Homer. Okay, the flora is complete for this biome. So there might be more in the uh, the polar ice cap. That, is that a big small one? <laughs> what does that mean? I need more fauna though. I've actually only finished the spiders. You'd think I would have finished the balloons since they've relatively left me alone, but nope. Yay, there we go. Two of six. Peaceful, aromatic, frozen dunes and sandy desert and health 20. Nice. I don't know if I should replicate myself or make Harley. Ooh. Well, you could do both and then do one off stream. So I need to get the creatures that are in this biome. There's also the dog. I still have not got the dog scanned at all. Insomnia eyeshadows. <laughs> these eye bags are designer. <laughs> right, we do need to scan these beasties. So I don't have enough ammo for this nonsense. I don't think I'd like to fight two of them at once, Sarah. So if we can maybe make that not happen, that'd be great. Yep. Okay. Nope. Oh, shit. So note to self, don't use pistol on these guys. It is not enough damage. 75%. I do need to do the other one, don't I? I do. Okay. That's why the sunglasses stay on. <laughs> All of Sarah Ing put the song Sarah Smile by Hollow Notes in my head. I don't think I know that song. There doesn't seem to be a way to make your own ammo, which I think is a necessity at this point because you used to be able to do it in Fallout New Vegas, apparently. I haven't played Fallout New Vegas. I just knew there was a Fallout game that you could. I had a mod that allowed you to do it in Fallout 4. He's learning how to dodge. All right. 88%, I have to do another one? <sighs> we finished these boys. Where is my ship? Oh, my ship is so far away. ship is so far away. I've done all of the plants, so I need to just finish the animals in this area. Do you know what? Um, so I was going to talk about bread and then I, I was in bread the food, not bread the person. And then I almost called you bread. Um, I could really go for one of those Mexican breads right now. The species will be extinct. Good, look at them harassing these little spider beasties. No, I'm kidding. No, the, so this is a mission that I got off the mission board and it's to finish surveying this planet. And that's great, but it's been quite tough and it has been the death of me. I've learned how to make them. You will have them again. Excellent. They were so good. Wonder what things unlock in late game. No idea. I don't know if I'll ever get there. <laughs> I will say... I've been playing so much of it recently that my wrist is actually super sore. And that is the first time Welcome. that I have had that. Tyriel, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome. Thanks for using your prime sub here. Welcome to campfire. I hope you enjoy your emotes. How long are we in the main quest? 15 minutes? I have no idea. At this point, I genuinely don't know. Is this a Saturday stream? It is. I'm going to be perfectly honest with you all. I had every intention of this being something I stream tomorrow as well. But with my wrist being the way it is and the fact that I'm traveling on Monday. On she scared the crap out of me because she was right in my ear. Sarah! <laughs> I like how some of the flavors we had were colors. Blue Gatorade and pink bread. Pink bread. It's my left arm. It's uh, my keyboard arm. Ow. Sarah, stop. I'm leaving her to clean up her own mess. There is a main quest. And apparently this time, the main quest, 
the story doesn't actually start or like it doesn't feel like the game starts until you've done the main quest which is really exciting for me because i'm a person who tends to avoid the main quest in elder scrolls and like fallout games and stuff uh this is exciting for me but i am currently avoiding the main quest anyway because that's just what i do um because i'm always worried that if i do the main quest i'll get locked out of stuff i do need to scan that one creature so we're on three of six there is another creature we've encountered here, but I have no idea where the heck they are. They're the like big crab boys. Thanks to your stars on real how many different good role playing games have been released in only a few weeks time. It's kind of wild. But yeah, with my um, wrist being so sore and uh, me traveling on Monday, I probably won't stream tomorrow and we'll take a little bit of a break. I also have been streaming every day for the last like five or six in a row so I remember when I started streaming this week <laughs> what is time and I will be streaming on Monday from London I really want to play more though it's just my wrist is really really sore <clears throat> she really does look at all these oh they were asleep never mind having a nap this thing i need to scan this thing how many of them do i need to scan though sarah sarah okay sarah sarah whatever will be will be i scanned it run <laughs> okay we're doing that then <laughs> They're running away from Sarah, as far away from Sarah as possible. Yeah, I wouldn't put that past them. So what are we on? We're on 25%. So they're only temperament wary. I might be able to avoid killing them. If I can find a way to get to them without... I'd run from her too. I'd run towards her. I wonder if there are any caves around here. These ones are sick too. I wonder if there's any way to help them. There's unknown stuff over here. What's that? Huh. Well, now I want to know what that is. Intriguing. I suppose it's a good thing I don't have to eat and drink, right? Imagine if they had a survival mode. I would probably play it, to be fair. I would probably play survival mode. I realize that uh, some people are having flashbacks to me playing Fallout again. Survival mode with melee only. <sighs> Why your oxygen depletes when you're not wearing a spacesuit? Well, I am actively wearing a spacesuit, but. <laughs> Over there. Interesting. I don't think your oxygen depleting because you're sprinting if you're not wearing a helmet is the problem because they're just using that as a form of stamina, right? It's the uh, CO2, CO2 accumulating. Maybe it means in your muscles. <laughs> uh, okay, so this way. Hopefully I have enough like distance that I can go. Those things were running towards me. <gasps> no, that's a piece of grass. I need to scan more of those little little guys on the floor. But I would really like to know what this icon means. Is there a person here in distress? Is it a distress call? The heck are these? Apparently they're not scannable, so. Oh, it's 1.94 gravity here. God, that'd be awful, Daphne. <laughs> Can you imagine? You'd use a space horse for these kinds of missions, maybe a land speeder. Yeah, I think having a vehicle would be pretty neat. Rather than having to just walk everywhere. But then I suppose that would make the landable areas seem significantly smaller. So I did some reading and it does seem like there are invisible walls. And if you've walked too far from your ship, you get told that you can either move to a new location or fast travel to your ship and then land somewhere else. But even so, the areas are still pretty big. I don't know why. So personally, I don't know why you would want to circumnavigate an entire planet on foot. It would take so bloody long. But 
for like realism I understand people wanting to be able to like not hit a wall I don't know the solution for it because I feel like the only oh there's another one of those crabs I feel like the only solution for it really is to make the planet smaller which I think would be worse if that makes sense oh <gasps> he killed that crab that's good for me I need to scan one of those I'm not sure. I don't know what the solution is. I don't know what way it would make sense. I am having a good time though. I'm not bothered. Oh, probably not very long at all. 38% scanned. Please don't aggro. Sarah will shoot you. You can circumnavigate planets and elite if you're patient enough, but those plans are so much less detailed. Exactly. That's the thing, right? If you, I feel like if you want the detail that's in this and the different things you can find, like you can't find caves in elite. Granted, the cave only had a rock in it, but like still, you can't find caves in elite. Whatever the fact this is. Um, so the fact that it's, there's much more to find. I don't know that with the amount of places you could land... Like the amount of planets you can land on and the moons you can land on with this many things to find on them and like quests and stuff to find. I'm not sure that you could do that fully open world. It's a tricky compromise, but not being able to just sit, jump into your ship and move a couple of kilometers away is a bit annoying. Yeah, no, it is annoying. I just don't know. I don't know what the solution would end up being other than what they've decided on. Unexplored geology feature. Scan this location to uncover something. I wish that would last longer as well so I can read it. I'm a slow reader. Then elite, the smallest planet walked around, took over a hundred hours. Really? There's another one of those crabs over there. This is kind of cool. Check this out. Unexplored geology feature. She scared me. You'd buy a Psyche branded land speeder. Eh. Oh, something over there. Can I climb this? So, how do you explore a geological feature? Do I have to get to the top? <laughs> Don't shoot the geology, Sarah! This says to fully, fully explore it to uncover its secrets. Does that mean getting in the water? Toxic metals, maybe not. Maybe not. Perhaps we do not want to get inside the water. How do you scan this or explore this, I guess? What's that? Oh, that's my ship. My ship's all the way over there. I have moved three and a half kilometers away from my ship. Oopsie. Hmm. Oh, there's another one of those crabs. I like my boost pack. Can you maybe see something under the water on the bottom? I'll have a look. Trilobites! Little guys! There's got to be something useful out here. Little guys! Ah, 88%. We need another one. There's got to be another one. We're at 50% of these. If I can get all of these and all of the little Trello bites, we'll only have the dog to do. Are you going to wear the cosplay on Monday? No. I would like to, but um, I don't have, I only have a carry-on backpack and I'd have to bring all my cosplay stuff and then I'd have to change and I don't really have time to change between when I land and when I get there because I cannot wear the cosplay to the airport. Is there a ring that raises your encumbrance way over the limit at the bottom of the lake? <laughs> Can you imagine? Ah, oh, this one here. This one's a big boy, but that would be the last one we need. Do I have any any like stuff to eat did say to scan the ge geological feature so maybe there's a way to spot us uh, the spot to scan it from yeah maybe i'm going back there in a second um alien broth and Doo -doo -doo. 
I did get rid of most of my food. I'm not eating the bread. I'm mm, no, I'm not eating the toast either. That's not. We're not in it for that. We're not in it to eat our friends. I'll do for now. He has three red bars at the bottom. That can't be good for me. Sarah, I need you to tank. Why is he running at me like that? Yikes! Oh, he threw stuff at me. Oh my God. Feel the full completion of me would spend a lot of time on planets. I, I re reject, reject that. I respect that. I don't reject it. So does killing it count as an immediate scan? Kind of feels like it does. Easy, never died of you. I don't believe you for even a second. So can I unexplored geology feature? Fast travel to this. No, I'm right here. I can see it. 80% surveyed. Am I going to have to find multiple locations to tick off the thing on the left? Maybe I have to get up there. Look at the like ice. Kind of cool. Oh, toxic minerals. That's not good. Perhaps shouldn't receive toxic stuff, huh? Also, would really like to know why this thing has like it looks like a health bar or not a health bar, like um. Do you know what I mean? What do you call those? They have a name. It makes me think there's somebody here. And like they've crashed and their ship has died and they're like sitting on this rock hoping somebody will rescue them. Which I suppose is possible. Can I scan these? No. Ah! Sarah! Jesus Christ! You can't just do that! She cannot do that. You have a plus 10% buff against toxicity. No. No, I am toxic. Can I go up there? I don't think so. What do you mean scan it? Oh, there we go. <laughs> this melting remnant of a retreating glacier in indicates a rapidly changing landscape. Thank you for that, Sarah. Okay. Does that... Oh, yeah. Look, on the left-hand side, I have three little, like, circly things. I'm gonna have to... I've got to scan three locations. I'm going to need to build an outpost here. Also, I'm beginning to think I need to move my camera up into the top right instead of the middle right. Because you can't read the descriptions if I do that. We could build an outpost near here, right? What was your question? So how do you build an outpost? What happens if I try to build an outpost? Do I have to be a certain distance away from stuff? I feel like I do. Hi, Drisha, how are you? I'm not sure if I can build an outpost. Maybe I need to be near my ship. It doesn't do anything here. Hope it's not paleo where you can only afford a tent. <laughs> Most Earth had an unknown trait and I didn't know what they were or how to find them you just find one so i guess you just have to wander around looking for pois ah yeah earth's kind of a shithole isn't it have i stolen anything today i don't think so it's gonna take me so much longer to finish this planet than i thought it would what's this different video game this week but you're popping in to see how starfield is i'm really enjoying it uh, your mileage may vary. You landed in Essex. Not much different. <laughs> I landed in London. Don't recommend. <laughs> Solely. <laughs> Especially that dude at the start of stream. <gasps> Go mountain. Sarah! Sarah? Sarah. Sarah. Please. Please. Sarah, please. Sarah, please. Oh my god. 
Unbelievable. Not lost. Being creative about where I go. So that's what those look like on the inside. <laughs> Sarah, what the fuck? Huge fan of space games. I'm still not totally sold on Starfield. So I'm not going to try and sell anyone on the game, but I will tell you that like, if you like Bethesda games, I believe you will enjoy it. If you don't like Bethesda games, this is what like people keep coming in and being like, should I play Starfield? If you don't like Bethesda like RPGs, you're not going to like it. If you do like Bethesda RPGs, why is this clicking at me? There's definitely a bug in that tree. Um, you won't enjoy it. If you've never played the company games, I think if you like open world games, then you'll enjoy it. I think you would need to have some enjoyment. Ooh, unexplored geological feature. I think um, if you like open world games at all, I think it's really fun. You kind of are left to your own devices, if you know what I mean. Dense roots, fibers, and other biotic structures merge into a nutrient-rich storage cluster that sits on channels extending off towards other clusters. This is weird. Hive structures. I do feel like that doesn't sound good. What else can we scan here? We've never been here, so is that not being lost? I That is called being adventurous. Lost is when you've lost your way and have no idea where to go. I keep trying to go back to my ship and then finding interesting things to do instead. Do I have to scan this one as well, or is it... Let's see. No, okay, this already counts as scanned. I think I might have to scan different things that aren't root structures, if you know what I mean. But I don't know why. I need three things to kind of this is uh, explored. Yeah, sidetracked. Find Thargoids. We're exploring. But yeah, also, if you don't play open world games necessarily, but you might be interested, I would say if you enjoy watching somebody play like Skyrim or Fallout or whatever. Or this, if you've already watched somebody play it, I think you'll probably enjoy playing it. But that's not always true. Sometimes people don't enjoy playing a game even though they watch it. I watch other people play games and there are games that I would never play or don't enjoy playing. I would like to get out of the hole now. I see they haven't changed that about Bethesda games. You're running too close to a thing. I know. You can no longer jump. <laughs> I need more stuff to, 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 to explore. I think these I might be able to explore. Psyche go down the hole. Anything yep. interesting? Okay, Ray? two of three. What the heck is this? It's a diff different kind of uh, hive structure. They definitely kept that on purpose. You know what I mean, right? Where you're like running against a hill and then you try to jump and your character's like, no, I have forgotten how to jump because I am too close to a structure. <laughs> I should call him. Ah, oh, no. Yeah. Sorry. I really need to scan these. 75%. I really need to f hurry up and finish this guy. And then we can move on to... Eh, hey, poop pile! I found a pile of poop. A literal pile of poop. Hi, Drahid. It's good. I'm enjoying it a lot. I did loot it. Of course I did. I stuck my hands directly in the poo pile. <laughs> Trying this on Game Pass next week to see how I like it. It's been fun watching others play, however. Yeah, I think if you've been enjoying watching people play, you'll probably enjoy it. Because you know what to expect, right? And, like, you're probably seeing different play styles. Um, my play style is, I accept, incredibly chaotic. One minute I will focus on the main story, then the next minute I will just go and decide I'm going to scan this entire planet because I want the money for the mission I have. Then I'll just get lost or whatever. I realize that most people pick one of those two types. Yay! Ecological Consortium. Like, a lot of people will pick one of those two types of playstyles, either doing the quests or being entirely lost all the time. I seem to flip between the two. 
but I feel like if you get a good idea of what the play style is like. Oh, another one. I think this might be our last one. I've said that before. I might need two more. Where did it go? Oh, shit. Ah! It's behind a rock. Sarah, please tank. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, but I'm not. 88%. We need one more. Shit. Okay. Let's look at the skills a little bit because I need to know if I need to do something specific for like outpost building and stuff. <laughs> Talon. The moment though, I just can't get enough of Goodbye Volcano High. I have never heard of that. I did level up. So targeting control systems. Missile weapons are favored because they can lock onto an enemy ship, but an intimate knowledge of tracking systems can make them even more effective. Unlock, sh unlocks ship targeting. Yes, please. I would like that. I would like that very much. Excellent. So that allows us to then go and possibly steal ships so that we can resell them. So we did find another ecological or geological site. We now have another one to do. And then this one's done. I love this place at nighttime. So we did that one. We did this one. Oh, wait. There, was there a trilobite? <gasps> there is. That would be the end of this. Yay! We scanned the little guy. Okay, cool. Having never played a Bethesda game, is it possible to level up so much you can get every single trait? Um, I don't... So, I think Pete Hines from Bethesda said he never reached a level cap in this. Generally speaking, you are probably going to want to focus on a couple of paths. I don't know if you could get every single trait. It might be that it's possible, but, like, it just would take so long that you probably won't. Um... For Skyrim, for example, I always picked like three or four traits to focus on and I've been able to max out all of them all the way uh, and get them to level 100 and like take all the perks. Um, but generally speaking, I've not, I've not ever, that's really pretty. I've not ever been in a position where I've been able to have more than that. But I don't think they have an explicit level cap. There are skill trainers, I believe. There are also permanent unlocks. So you can find comic books and the comic books give you like a permanent 5% decrease to certain damage types and stuff. There's one more boy. One more crabby boy. And then we can go to the polar ice caps to find the wolfy boy. And then that'll be it. We'll have done it. Get over here. I'm ready for you. Yeah, the base traits. I feel like taking at least one of all of the base traits is a good move and then focusing on... Um, like one or two trees to max out the ones that you're most interested in. Right. I'm glad you're so he's done. Messy work. Thanks. I, that is so pretty. The lighting whenever it does this is so nice. Like look at the way the blue light comes over the tops of these. That's so cool. And like if you look, it's just really like, I don't know. It's really neat. It's really neat. It's neat that where I am and where the sun is and stuff actually makes sense. Do you know what I mean? I like I know Elite does that too. But these are two very different games. Like that's so cool. I love it. Right, okay. So I think we finished here because yeah, we've biome completed the fauna and the flora. So I need to travel back to my ship. Yes. And then before I do anything else, I like this planet at nighttime. It's really pretty. Before I do anything else, I think the grayness Hello, issue is a certain planet yeah. thing. Basically, the volcanic planets are gray rocks and gray grind against gray sky. That is fair. Like, I think this looks really nice. Good day, Captain. Thanks. Also, if you have a name that he understands, he will pronounce your name. It's just that apparently he doesn't understand Psyche. So just to confirm. Oh no, I can build an outpost here. <gasps> I don't know that I want this to be my planet though. 
He said this game is more like Elite Dangerous No Man's Sky or Star Citizen. It's really its own thing. Yeah, I would say it probably has more similarities in this gameplay to like a combination between Elite Dangerous and No Man's Sky, but it is definitely its own thing. It's, it's an RPG at its heart. And I think if people come into it expecting like a better Elite or a better No Man's Sky or a better Star Citizen, they're going to be disappointed because it doesn't play like any of them. It has features that are similar and it has mechanics that are similar, but it, it do, it's Let's not the same. Do something new today, uh -huh. I just don't know if I want to live on this planet yet. I know I could probably build... Can you build any number of outposts? Probably. No problem. I'm checking the polar ice cap. Yeah, it's very much like Skyrim in space. 100%. That was my expectation of it as well. There's been a lot of people who've come in and been disappointed with the space flight. Huh? Oh, okay. Yeah, maybe we'll go go to his farm. Urgent. I'm sure it can wait, though. <laughs> Yeah, me too, but Earth. <laughs> Landing silence, please. Ooh, this looks interesting. Urgent ish. Where look, his his message had to get to me from the opposite side of the system. I'm sure he can wait a few more minutes for me to finish this place. We go to 82 already? Unfortunately, I don't believe it exists. Andy! Space boop. Space boop. Thank you for the reset. Happy 22 months. Welcome back. Welcome back. Time to visit that farm based pirate ambush. I'm definitely going to get like shot by pirates, aren't I? That is definitely what's going to happen. Hi, Vasco. Right, we're looking for a puppy. Puppy! I found a puppy. Let's go. I need to use my auto run so I'm not putting so much pressure on my wrist. Puppy, don't go. I also now officially need more ammo. I uh, had 1,000. You just let looted a legendary helmet? Nice, what's it do? So we have one flora here, I think, and one fauna. And the fauna is the puppy. The flora, I have no idea. I guess I just didn't finish one of the ones we found the other day. Maybe that one? It'd be really great if it was this one. Fuck. It was that one. 25%! Ah! On. Sarah! Sarah, do something! Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, the puppies are gonna have to die! They are aggressive and they fucking kill me! Oh my god, why are there so many of you? Can you all please just eat your dinner and then I'll scan you and move on. <sighs> 94%. I'm sure that that puppy is not going to chase me down the hill. It's okay, Sarah might keep him distracted. Oh, they're not real. Don't listen to Sarah. Don't listen to Sarah. Tell the puppies to stop attacking me and then I'll stop shooting them. Anti-ballistic galvanized repulsing, a lot of stuff. Nice. I like my suit because of this. <laughs> um, more puppies. Hey, for puppies. <laughs> he just wanted to play. Yeah, with my intestines. Game doesn't force you to worry or care about a baby. You only saw for three seconds. Like Fallout 4. Yeah, Fallout 4 was a bit rough in that regard. <laughs> T was like, I really don't like this whole your family has been taken away from you business. <laughs> All right. The closer I can get to these, I need to scan these. This might be the last scan I need to do for them. Please don't attack me. Please don't attack me. Oh, I really do not need to have three of them attack me at once. Protect your food. That's fine. I won't come for your food. You protect your food. Eat your food. Eat your snackies. 88% shit. 
Oh, there's another one here. Ah! Ten puppies jump. Puppies can jump. Puppies can jump. Puppies can jump. Ah! Puppies can jump. Puppies can jump. Puppies can jump. <laughs> they never warned me of this dog killing addiction you have. I swear, I'm not gonna kill him if I can avoid it. There's more puppies. I need one more. Sarah might have died. It is possible Sarah has died. Look, she knew what she was getting herself into when she came on this mission. Stop shooting things. We did it. Right. I finished that. 96%. We need to find one more thing. Ow! Fuck. Okay. I'm okay. Sarah, stop! You have aggroed everything! <laughs> She's aggroed everything on this planet. Right. I'm just going to ignore her while I find out. There! Another glacier, it might be it might be the same type, in which case it doesn't count. How high can they jump? Apparently not that high. Apparently not that high. Speaking of xenomorphs, I'm still tripping on the fact that the alien queen is my Disney princess. I love it. With this character's death, the thread of prophecy is severed. Restore a previous game to restore the weave of fate, or persist in the doomed world you have created. Jeez. I suspect this might end up being the same type as the one we've already scanned, but I don't know if that'll matter. <laughs> Leave Sarah on the ship. She will aggro everything. She will aggro absolutely everything. Friends, I cannot tell you how different this game is now that I can hear everything. I I was having such a very weird experience where uh, anything behind me didn't exist. <laughs> That little balloon just hissed at me. I will deflate you. Literally anything behind me didn't exist because I had my cable slightly unplugged. <laughs> Raven, one of the cats pulled the cable out partially. Right, I really need more ammo. Now, right, does this count? As something I have to scan? Let's find out. Up there with me wearing my headset backwards. Oh yeah! And Solu always thought everything was happening on the wrong side. That was funny. It was Az, wasn't it? Probably. He kept trying to sit on the mixer, so I wouldn't... Really? I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> okay. Shit! Okay, this doesn't count because I've already scanned one, so I need to find another one. If that's another glacier. There's another one there. That's actually closer. Is it closer to my ship? Yeah, it's closer to my ship. Um, fast travel. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Yeah, there we go. Look at those trees! Where are those? Never learned what's left and what's right. Left and right is hard. It's fine. You're just a girl. It's fine. I'm just a girl. I don't know. I don't know how to plug in cables. Well. Find Rainbow Six Siege extremely hard with headphones backwards. I bet you did. Right, where was the? Please disregard. I attempted an informal greeting, but I am dissatisfied with the result. Hi. Please disregard. <laughs> Bless him. Did you hear that? Uh, hi. Please disregard my attempt at a an informal greeting. I am dissatisfied with the results. You've run out of sour sweets? Oh no. I actually dropped some sweets on the floor last night and I was really upset. Also, I had my Timbits. I'm going to be honest with you, those were the best. <laughs> they were so good. I got cinnamon ones. They were really tasty. Test greeting. Please ignore Oh, there's a puppy there. I am genuinely trying to avoid killing the wildlife, regardless of whether puppy or crab. I don't care. I will try. But if they attack me and I have nowhere to go, I ain't dying. Speaking of which, I should quick save. I did not put any in my pockets for Monday. I'm actually thinking I might not bring my jacket with me on Monday because I am genuinely scared that it'll be taken off me or like I'll lose it or somebody will steal it or it'll get ripped or damaged or something. And it's so cool. 
But did you eat them after? I ate the one that didn't st sit underneath the cupboard where all the dusty stuff is. I considered rinsing it off though. Genuinely, oh, for flip's sake. Uh, that only kinds of it happens during the stream. You can't take things I've done in my past and hold them against me. What are you, my mom? <laughs> I spent so long trying to work out how to get this crystal clear feature, crystal crater feature to acknowledge a scan, but it's now nighttime. Oh no, that's the worst. Like, do I just have to scan that? Oh, there's two of these. I'm sure there's some microbial nearby. community tendrils filter through the air and ground for nutrients and relay sensory information to the microbially microbial colony very cool i'm guessing this is the other one i did it the planet is complete we surveyed the planet mission rewards whoop, whoop. did i get the money for it and everything or do i have to hand it back in did i get money I don't know if I got money or not. Did I? I think I did. I, I'm sure I did. It must have been. It seems weird that they don't tell you what your reward is. But I did it. We finished it. Let's find a nicer planet with even more puppies to kill. <laughs> that looked like a bee. Right. What are my missions like? So... Oh, I should probably help this guy in the system. He's on a Ridney tour. I kind of want to smack though. This never gets old. Whee! Off we go. So many missions. I took so many from that mission board. It was ridiculous. I just walked up to it and was like, yes, I will take everything. Indeed. Question, what happens if you just like fly directly out of planet? Do you eventually just land? All right, let me do a full save. I need to get a snack. I'm also really cold. My house is getting chilly. I'll be back in a second. Now it's a great time to get up and stretch your legs, your arms, your butt, get a snack, get a drink, take your beds, I'll close your jaw, relax your shoulders, stop sitting like a shrimp. Solely made us. <laughs> is it hidden? Is it safe? It's a stolen sandwich. Right, we're talking to this guy. Wait, can I actually just plot to that from here? Show on map, set course. Set course, yeah. Travel. Kind of sandwich, chicken and mayonnaise. Technically, it was his sandwich because I he was making himself a sandwich. Now, can I have a sandwich? So he gave me the sandwich. <laughs> you know, he would charge that planet with that thing twice. <laughs> Wide forest. Okay, so what's the situation here? Lopez's farm. What's he got? What's going on? He's either he, do you know what? Scan. Oh, that's cool. I haven't done that before. Cat hair, man. That's super cool. Bloody cat hair. So this is definitely gonna be an ambush, right? This is definitely gonna be an ambush. It has to be. Wide Boris is a giant bear in a tracksuit. Doing Everything this. <laughs> Walking towards the camera. This doesn't look like a farm. I also got an energy drink. This does not look like a farm. Maybe it is. People who type BTTV emotes without being able to see them are the real MVPs. I do wonder if sometimes the people Oh look he's reading. Um do it because they think the word is the meme. An organ farm, maybe. Greetings, Captain. Hi. Hello. I'm not afraid to use this to defend my home and my family, but they didn't specify. Sure as hell don't look like any spacer I've seen before. What does that mean? 
Put that gun. Put down that gun if you know what's good for you. You're the one who sent the distress call. Easy there. But you came here. What, to help? Looking for some sort of reward? Yeah. I want to know more before I commit either way. Send some more. <laughs> Used to be four families that list help set up stakes in this system. We rarely saw eye to eye in the best of times. And believe me, True, these ain't the best of times. And not the Spacers truth. started raiding and it's been getting worse. Only a matter of time before they end us all. Unless you're willing to help some hard-working, pig-headed settlers out. Okay. Who are the four families? Can you tell me about list? The League of Independent Settlers. Good-meaning fools happy to set colonists up in an independent space. Okay. The promise is freedom. True freedom. If you can fend off all the spacers and pirates, the settled systems can throw at you. Uh-huh. Who are the four families? The Wens and the Bandas are farmers like me. Jacqueline the mayor and her daughter have some mining operation with dreams of hitting it big. I've tried in the past to get us to work together, but you don't join List unless you have a healthy dollop of obstinacy. <laughs> Lots of challenges in independent space. Really? I had no idea. The spacers have taken out the family's List satellites, so we can't even talk to each other. Isolate and eliminate a classic tale. You fix the Lopez satellite, and I'll open a secure channel, and we can sync up and get the lay of the land. And then get all of our satellites operational. Okay. Why haven't you fixed it? I have. Twice. <laughs> I took out the old pickup. Last time I tried, I barely made it out alive. Okay, cool. They're using the damn satellites as bait. My ship just isn't up for facing spacers, but yours... A whole different animal. Uh oh. Why do you need these list satellites? List set us up with some secure communication satellites. Makes it hard for Riff Raff to pick us up. Well, in theory, the other families won't respond to communications on open channels. I figure if I didn't risk the distress call, we're all dead in. Anyway. Awesome. Hi, P Max. Go oh, good. Time to get to work. Just get that reward ready. Absolutely. I mean, don't expect much. <laughs> Look around. Not exactly swimming in resources here. But hey, good luck. The <laughs> wide bar is so funny. Okay. <laughs> Welcome to BTTV, Mozart. <laughs> it's Perman, I'm just staring at him. Just fix my satellite, and I'll let you know what to do. I'm gonna next. have a little look around. Can I go into your building? And before he shoots me. You bought it? Let's go to space, sweetie! Hell yeah. Crash, there's nothing on the plate. I had it all. I eated the sandwich. I'll take the ammo. I love how this doesn't kind of stealing. Eggmund. Ammo, ammo. Oh, oops, I stole his tissues. <laughs> I didn't mean to. <gasps> Can't pick up the plant. Literally a broken game. Unplayable. Can you take a ship? Oh, there's a question. I can take his coffee mug. <laughs> what are they gonna do? Arrest me? Have to catch me first. I'm like a whippet. <laughs> no, but he's worth money. Hell yes, baby. I love to see it. Hello, person. Someone responded to the distress call? I did. He got mugged. <laughs> carrying too many odds and ends. I know. Where are you? <laughs> She's yelling at me from over here. Why? Where are you? Sarah? Has Sarah got a stealth suit on or something and she's just gone invisible? Hey, May, did you just chase Crash in here? I think she did. It beeped a little if you put him on your ship. Where did you come from? 
Mom. You got something for me? She's so pretty. Feel are you free all to drop some stuff into They my are bag. licking my plate. May may honey. I ate my sandwich. Curly honey, I ate my sandwich. Do you like to see the little guy? Oh. He's just a little guy. He's just a little guy. He's so chunky. He's just a little guy. <laughs> My sweet baby. And he doesn't stink. But he's very chunky. He's got so chunky. Look at his little ears. You want to go down? Mwah. Don't don't grab the microphone. You can go that way. There you go. He hates being held, but I'm trying to encourage him to learn how to be held so that if I ever have to give him medication or take him to the vet or whatever, that he's okay with it. It's okay. You licked my plate. Good job. You got his feelings hurt because of ours. <laughs> He tolerates it, but he sits like really like tense. So when I hold him, he curls into a little ball and just like squeezes really, really tight. Meme is the same, but she like stares at the she stares at the ceiling with her feet sticking out. <sighs> Wash, same, same. Um, how do I wait a second? You tell. Oh no! Okay. I am now confused. Can I? Whose inventory am I in? This is mine. Yeah. Where am I? Resources. Store all resources. Until That's later. Good. I'm so lost. Okay, so he wants me to go the repair some satellites. Back yeah, all right. I can do that. Hello, Captain. Hello. I should probably just go to the cockpit every time, but I don't. Look at this crew. I'm all ears. Music's a little bit eerie, don't you think? Why do I feel like this is going to go badly? Right, so we literally have to go... There are probably spacers there. Okay. Let's find out. What's the worst that can happen? Time to test those new targeting systems. See if we can sell some ships, eh? Hey, Kisha. Space is about to get space. I want to try and board a ship. That'd be really cool. Oh, spacer Raven. Raven, no. I'm sorry. I'm going to steal your ship. How do I target? Target lock. Oh, this is cool! Engines. Target lost. Shit. I need their engines. Select system. Yes. Have I selected it? Engines are selected. I think that's right. Yes. The grab drive is out of commission. Your ship's hull integrity. Oh yeah, shit. To repair your ship. Crash. Okay. Oh, I'm going to die. <laughs> Crash jumped in front of my screen and then I was like, press O to burn your ship. And I pressed O and nothing happened. Yeah, I'm not sure. I think I might have been too late to repair your ship. Crash! Yeah, he stood directly in front of my screen. It's okay, we'll try again. I'm not sure how the targeting system works, but it's kind of interesting. 
I just need to see, like, do I need to be locked on for an extended period of time, or how does it work? Was it an O or a zero? Oh, good question! It might have been zero! T1 of the death in the game. It's true. Maybe it was a zero, because a zero to heal, that would make more sense. Target lock. Okay. A little missile wouldn't hurt, right? Or, well, I mean, it would. Ideally, it would hurt them. Oh, you can get more information on there. long does it take to kill their... I feel like I'm not targeted their engines. On their engines. Is it... Tar like, how do I know if it's locked or not? Yeah, that... They blew up. They blew up. <laughs> okay. It is not zero. It must be O. It is O. It just takes time. Can I loot this, please? How do I loot? Why can I not loot this one? I'm sorry! <laughs> you can try and run. I'm stuck. On their engines. Do I have to do it in this menu, maybe? Maybe you have to do it in that menu. Maybe you have to shoot them in this menu. Yeah, you must have to shoot them in this menu. That's gonna blow up! Yeah, I'm not sure. I must be doing something wrong. What is hitting me? Who is shooting me? Another one. Let's see if we can try this. And I do like that it slows down in that menu, for sure. I'll bring their thing down. I just want to steal their shit, that's all. Lost target. I do think that's what it is. That's the wrong target. Oops. Critical hit hull. That's fine, but their engines need to go. Like they're gonna die. And I wanna I wanna board! How do you board their ship? Yeah, it's like bats. don't understand how to bring their engines offline because that's what they said to board the ship right was to take their engines offline i have no idea thank you so Lou. yeah i don't know what it, i don't know what's going on there or how that works i'd like to loot hi the fuck why can't i not loot there we go Got it. There's more loot over here.
Did you notice sometimes you were shooting at the engines on the other side of the ship, so you're just hitting hull? Yeah, but I don't think you can actually, like, change that. Because it slows... If you know what I mean, it slows down. And then you would have to, like, get to the other side somehow. Maybe you have to wait till they're facing away from you or something? Yeah, I have the tar targeting control systems. That's why I was able to target their engines there. Oh, well. No, there's no lateral thruster. I don't think, anyway. It always made it seem so easy in Star Trek. <laughs> Video did what you did, got behind them, went into the menu, shot the parts you were locked onto. Maybe I just wasn't behind them. Maybe I was doing too much damage to the hull and not enough damage to the engines. Because I was hitting, hitting them from the side sometimes. There. Excellent. Sending the data on the other satellites. You Maybe it's just me. that I have to get behind them. Hello? Yeah, I can hear you. Um, I fake static blueberry, fake static elephants. I blueberry elephants. Wait, what? Oh, hardy ha ha. <laughs> it's gonna take some time dealing with someone competent. I don't suppose you want a job working hydroponics. No one Not really. Says yes to that. Not really. <laughs> Once you repair the other satellites, I'll open a channel to the other families. Okay. All right, so the next one is what? Fucking miles away, right? Um, One here, one here. We did this one already, right? No, wait, we didn't. We're over here. No, we're not. We're here. Okay, we did this one already, so we'll do this one. More science? I do need a better ship as well. I might have some time faffing around with the shipbuilding. Oh, I'm level 11. Doo -doo. Um, I could increase my persuasion. That would be actually really handy. 20% increased chance of succeeding when persuading someone. Yes, please. Looks like you need specific weapons to disable engines. Lasers won't do it. I was using ballistics. Are you telling me that the ballistics weapons didn't work? Like, do you need a special weapon for it? Well, I, a locked on message to the engines. No, I was in the uh, thingy menu. The uh, sub target menu, but there was no lock on thing. I just had Lopez engines targeted. To win. Lopez to win. When? When? This does not sound good. When? Please. <sighs> we may be the three families now. Oh, no. I hope the other families are okay. The sooner we make contact with them, the better. Okay. Didn't say anywhere that you needed a special kind of weapon to disable drives, though. Also, I already did it once before. It's just that I did it as part of a story mission, so it seems kind of odd that they would say that that doesn't count. No. So, I just don't know. I want to go to the thing. Hello. I would like to go to the communication satellite. There we go. More pips to ballistics. I think that would just involve me doing more damage to the ship and him dying. <laughs> just want to board a ship and steal someone's ship. I do feel like I'm, I'm surprised there's not more people here to shoot me. Oh, I had to say something, didn't I? <laughs> I just had to say something. <laughs> See, this is the menu here. Whoops. Crap. I 
need to get behind them. And then while I'm behind them, I need to target. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What do you mean? Yeah, they're coming back towards me now. I need to destroy these first because uh, otherwise I'm going to die. That's the satellite. I'm just shooting at a satellite instead of the fucking spacer. So you see here? Like, I died. I'm pretty sure I'm shooting their engines there. But how do you lock on to the individual squares? So if you look here, I have targeting control systems. Unlocks ship targeting functionality. I don't think there's anything else I need to do. I don't think there's anything else I need to do. It's just that, okay. I do think I need, maybe need to not be shot by three different people at the same time though. Being shot at three, shot at by three people is, oh, this one's a raccoon and it's level 12. That's not ideal. Jesus Christ, they hit really hard. You say nice work. I am in agony. So much pain! Jesus Christ! These might be a little bit beyond my capabilities right now. They do so much damage! I don't think we can. I don't think we can fight these. They are messing me up. Whew. There's a gray bar of engine health above the hull health when you lock onto it. Okay. I am, um, you know what? Your mission can wait. I don't care if you're the three families or whatever the fuck. I'm gonna go get a tree branch from someone. <laughs> fuck that. <laughs> I will come back here later. <laughs> Heck you and your fucking tree. <laughs> I can get to Alpha Centauri and then I'm gonna have to uh, jump one at a time. Bye. Fuck your satellites. I'm gonna go hug a tree. That was painful. Hi Muffin, how are you? I hate being shot by three different guys. The instructions are pretty vague. Maintain your current course or scan your ship's cargo. Okay. Bip, 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 bip. Scan complete. You're clear to land I'm not landing land. at New Atlantis though. I don't think. No, I'm moving on. So our next jump is... Oh, we can go straight here now. Uh, to... Uh, Kila City. It is a Kila City, right? Yeah. It's the orange column needs to be depleted within the lock on menu. I'll have a look at it again whenever I'm actually fighting something that's not a group of three level 12s when I'm level 10. Sent you a picture from the video. I love how it claims it's 20 degrees outside and I'm absolutely freezing today. Yes. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. That makes sense. It's just the thing that I was shooting at. So I don't really know why. Weird. Super weird. The rock in Aquila City is- I'm level 11 actually. So I'm not sure why they were stuffed. Ooh, hello.
We have arrived in a different place. Get up! You need to manage fuel. I have not had to manage fuel uh, at all so far. I've had absolutely no problems with fuel so far. Hi. Captain, do you require my assistance? No, it's okay. Who this? Oh, Sam. All right, we're here. You ready? Because once we get started, I'm going to be riding your tail until this is over. What do you mean? Filthy! <laughs> what about Cora? Is she coming? She stays with the ship, usually. Got a few more years to go before I let her swill whiskey in some backwater mm. bar. They do almost no hull and shield damage and crap ton component damage. Gotcha. Yeah, go on then. There's uh, something you should know up front. I'm a co. As in Solomon Co. First man on Aquila. That tale I mentioned before, the one I think is connected to an artifact, it's something of a family legend. After planet fall, Solomon spent years mapping Aquila, and he found a tiny little patch of nothing on his senses. The kind of nothing an artifact produces. He called it the Empty Nest. Empty Nest. Said it was a place even the wildlife of Aquila wouldn't go. I like how he said, I'm a co, like I was going to know what that meant. Um, hold on a second. I just need to bask in your celebrity status. You're actually related to the man who funded our entire faction. Yeah, sorry. thought you were just being polite, not mentioning it and all. Did I miss a my wife? Yes. people who don't know me assume my last name is Co because the name's so damn Hi, popular Rosa. in the Freestar Collective. How are you? Thanks to Solomon. Once they find out I'm part of the legacy, things get... Not complicated. So I try not to advertise it. Uh huh. Um. Why not just find, use a planet scan to find it? Because you'll find a whole lot of nothing. Gravitational anomalies are a little hard to pick up in an area with tons of starship traffic. Okay. Not to mention all the electronics from the city and security scramblers that the Free Star or smugglers out on the frontier put down. Okay. Hold on, I just need to <laughs> bask in your celebrity status. Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> Smart ass. This is why I don't like bringing it up. I'm kidding. Solomon's maps are locked up tight in the local gal bank. We'll be heading there. Okay. Let's go. Where are you going? <laughs> are you okay? He's so aggressive. All right. His people needed him. Apparently. I'm going to go ahead and sell some stuff. Um, sell from ship inventory. Holy moly. I have so much crap. I'm keeping this. Because I have one of those. They're so aggressive. Where does he put his hat when he wears a helmet? On top. <laughs> uh, the coffee mugs are not going anywhere. Um, why do I have two digi picks? I would like those in my inventory. A dinner plate. Empty chunks packaging. An empty stadium display. A fire extinguisher. A levitating desk planet. Two Newton's cradles. 14 Nova Galactic coffee mugs. An open container. A planetary system sculpture. Many plants. A pot. A pot lid. Many succulents. A Terra Bruta Go Cup, a toy spaceship, and a water pitcher. Um, I wanted to keep all of these. Actually, I don't really need this one. And I wanted to keep these because they're kind of cool. Um, I've got no real weapons that I need. See, the resources are currently taking up, I think, the most space. Like, if we look at weight, for example, we have, like, nuclear fuel rod this all of these i wish these weren't heavy 
Or that they didn't take up space on your ship or something. You bought two from a merchant yesterday? Yeah, but I don't think they went into my space or my ship inventory. I don't know why there's two in my ship inventory. Um, I have 13 iridium. But I need that for something. I'm actually tracking that. Um, yeah, so like I have a lot of stuff that's just, it's very expensive. You know? That's not a problem. Hi, Commander Coder. How are you? This is nice. I like it here. Hi. Hold it. Uh oh. By order of Marshal Daniel Blake, I need to inform you we've got some trouble at Gal Bank. Uh oh. Folks might be in danger, so you may want to steer clear. Never a dull moment around here. <laughs> I know you. You Sam Co. Marshal will be damn glad to have another Free Star Ranger helping out. I'm afraid your information is a couple years out of date. Um, what's the trouble? Well, all I know is there was an attempted bank robbery and things Ooh, a bank robbery. You'd have to ask the marshal if you want the whole story. Um, how do I get to Galbank? It's just behind me on the right. He's way too happy considering this bank so robbery. You steer clear unless you can help out. Is Marshal Blake in charge of security? Not usually, but he took charge of the situation because the bank robbers are part of the Shaw gang. Oh, okay. The marshal's had a lot of experience dealing with the gang, so... He's calling the shots. All right. If people are in danger, then I want to help. I guess that'd be the marshal's call. Samco like that. Frankly, it ain't going well. Looks to be a stalemate. Maybe a little outside help would do some good. Maybe. Well, I doubt those robbers are going to let us leisurely peruse the Galbank vault. Probably not. We better see if we can help move the situation along. Let's go. You stay where I can see you, Marshal. Keyless City. Feels like I spent half my life trying to get out of this place. Well, there's the to bike. Tell me your demands at some point. You find someone we can trust, and maybe we will. Oh no, they're gonna Why get me to talk it out. Not you, not one of your rangers, and not these city guards neither. <sighs> uh oh. Pinkerton. Hey. You need to stand back now. Um, sounds like you could hear. You could use some help. I don't mean to be rude, but it looks I like Rad Foreman. You. Now Talking or specialty with my guns. Keeler City at its finest, I see. Never a dull moment. Well, I'll be damned. Sam. The Cole. very same. Been a long time. I just want to shoot them. I, I think you probably my could. Breath about you being here to take the badge again. Uh, listen, Sam, just so you know, I don't blame you for how it went down. For the others, though, you might get a different reception. Thanks. I appreciate you saying so. But I figure some of that reception is owed. Still, I appreciate the sentiment, Marshal. It seems you got a situation. As I friend, live and breathe. The answer you're looking for. <laughs> All right, Sam. I'll trust your judgment on this one. <laughs> some no, folks she... from the Shaw Gang tried to rob the place, but they got spotted by a guard. They took everyone inside hostage. Pretty much, Daphne. They're keeping a watch this so we can't TV. move against them. They're using the intercom to communicate. Okay. Um, so it's like they got the drop on you pretty good. Embarrassing. <laughs> Tell me about the Shaw Gang. It's a big group that hides outside the city and runs smuggling jobs off world. They take in all kinds, rookies and veterans alike. Judging by their lack of preparation, I'd say this particular group is green as hell. Probably their first attempt at ice. Okay. That should work in our favor. Right about now. They're probably wishing they just stayed home. They must have made some demands by now. They won't talk to me. Strangest episode of trying to the badge. <laughs> They want a neutral negotiator. In other words, they didn't have a plan for this, so they're stalling while they come up with one. Now, what are you doing right now? So what's your plan? Without demands, I ain't got much to work with. About all we can do is wait. That's a great and see. plan. Maybe I can talk some sense into them. Hmm. All right, I'm willing to allow that. But a few things first. He's not Say stalling what at all. To, but whatever they ask for, there's no way in hell I'm giving it to them. That's going to go well. Also, there are lives at stake, so don't get cavalier. I never get cavalier. Find out what they want, and then report back to me. Take it slow and steady. Look for every opportunity to de-escalate. You got this. Okay. You in the bank. I'm sending in a negotiator, so don't shoot. Hands 
see why things are the way they are. Okay. But they're all staring at me! <laughs> Seems we've got a little excitement on our hands. Yeah, Maria, we do. I'm coming. Hello. You're the negotiator, huh? Yep. You think you're just gonna walk up here and get us to surrender? I honestly could not give less of a shit. What's your name? Uh, it's Jed. Jed. My name Jed. Good to meet you, Jed. I'm Psyche. Well, ain't you polite. So tell me, stranger. <laughs> Every how landline. Do I know you're gonna deal straight with us. Because you're not the only one who's had trouble with the law. <laughs> That's cool. I heard that. Okay, so let's talk. Um, what's the condition of the hostages? They talk too damn much. Complain about everything. But as much as we'd like to, none of us has shot one. <laughs> That's me talking about you, chat. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, tell me your demands. We want to guarantee a safe passage to the spaceport and a ship. That's true. I can't give it to we'll them. Drop the hostages off somewhere safe in the system. After that, we'll radio back where they are, and the marshal and his crew can come and get them. But if anybody follows us when we break orbit, we start shooting people. Got it? Take a while to get you a ship. It's a pretty tall order. How do I know you'll keep your word? What? Do you think we want to stay locked up in here? Hell no! Toxicity? That's me. That's a pretty tall order. Then persuade the marshal that it ain't. <sighs> this whole damn job's gone wrong. Bank robberies never go it's well. To be just a quick hit. Clean and simple, you know? Hurt so my flea just, wings. Let's all try to keep our heads, yeah? Because my guys, they're going crazy in here. I don't know how much longer we can last. If <laughs> only your true identity was Metal Kiss. It's not too late to end this peacefully. Okay. Per oh, <laughs> this is a tough persuasion check. Give up now and you'll do some time, sure, but nowhere near as much as you would if a hostage dies. You might as well let the prisoners go. You think they're keeping you safe, but they're not. You know the marshal can't let you get away with this. Damn it. I didn't think of it that way. Marshal's going to keep those sa hostages safe, whatever it takes. Let them go before he has to take drastic action against you. I know. I know. I'm not disagreeing with that. Surrender now before anyone gets hurt and things will be a lot better for you. What if your hostages have families? You really want to deprive children of their parents? <sighs> Part of me just wants to be rid of these people. Shit. But we need them right where they are. Nah, it's too late to back out now. I tried. We're seeing this through. You go tell the marshal to get that ship ready so we I needed can all more walk points. away from this thing without anybody. I needed more hurt. points for the time that I had. Shit. Can I not try again? But if you do a bank robbery, you don't have to worry about having a roof your head for at least 10 years either way. <laughs> do I... Did I save before I did this? Because I kind of want to try that conversation again. Did I do this? I might do... I might try that again. Purely because I really want to see if I can get the persuasion to work for me. You've just found a shepherd's pie. I find one in a microwave? Seems we've got a little excitement on Yeah, okay. I want to try that again. Because I, you can have save scum. You're I don't mind. Think you're just gonna walk up here and get us to surrender? Right, okay. Um, what's your uh, name? I'm Psyche. So tell me, stranger, how do I know you're gonna deal straight with us? Because you have you're not the only one who's had trouble with the law. That. Okay, so let's talk. Um, what's the condition of the hostages? The like me before I have to roll a 20 on a d20 and pg3. <laughs> Some of your demands. A safe passage. We'll drop the hostages off. After that, we'll radio back where they are and the marshal and Imagine expecting a straight again. dealing here. But if anybody follows us, will we... Uh, I don't know. You keep your words. And then that's a pretty tall order. Then persuade the marshal, then... Right. So let's just... Persuade. What do you mean? So. Oh, this is different. If even one hostage dies, your robbery charge becomes a murder charge. You don't want that to happen. Yeah. That would be a lot worse. Yeah, right? So? Uh, you might as well let the prisoners go. You think you're keeping them, they're keeping you safe, but they're not. I would need a two 
I feel like this might be. Nice try. Shit. But the Shaw Gang don't scare that. Yeah. Easy. Okay. <sighs> don't make them pay for your mistakes. You believe me, we never meant to take hostages. Critical Nobody success. Hurt. So maybe the judge won't come down too hard on us. Yeah. I think this has gone on long. Our critical success. You go tell the marshal we'll come quietly. You'd make a decent ranger with the way you handled that. Samco liked that. Yeah, we definitely didn't save Scum. That crit success is the only reason that worked. I was fecked otherwise. <laughs> Quite a spectacle, isn't it? My God, Maria, get a hobby! Uh, that's not true. She's already got a hobby. It's this. <laughs> this What's is her hobby. <laughs> Streamer luck. Um, I hope you've got a nice reward for me, Marshall, because I just saved the day. First things first. How'd you get the Shaw Gang to stand down? That's. Don't be hasty. I don't know why. <laughs> I convinced them it was the right thing to do. I won them over with my irresistible charm. I scared them into submission. You did. You think? Didn't think I could do it. To be honest, no. I wow. didn't. The Shaw Gang isn't. Who are you, my mom? <laughs> Good thing these were rookies. Hi, JJ. We've been dealing with some of the higher ups. Things might have gone right. <laughs> um, I won them over with my irresistible charm. <laughs> well, you don't like for confidence. Well, I bet you could sell dirt to a dusty. Here, you've more than earned this. What do you get you me? You got us out of a tough spot. You did it with courage that's not common. I also saved scum. As a matter of fact, <laughs> you might just be free star ranger material. If you're interested, head on over to the rock and ask for Emma Wilcox. She handles the new recruits. Is it Saturday? It is Saturday. It is Saturday. Right. Now that lives aren't on the line, let's Ooh, get give me some money. See if we can get those maps. Okay. I got deputized. Him just running around. Okay, well, I released all the hostages, so I guess maybe I'll have a little peek inside. Well, no, look, I'm not here for your mission. I'm here for something else. Deputized. Marshal Daniel Blake directed me to speak to Ranger Emma Wilcox at the Rock in Aquila City if I'm interested in joining the Free Star Rangers. I am here to get a tree. I'm here to pick up a tree branch, Sam. You're just going to have to be patient, okay? Now just do that 50 times so we can get the big ship. <laughs> you got bonus money for doing it safely? Nice. Just woke up, launched Sea of Stars before I get ready to go to a nude beach. Have the best time! Co Heritage Museum. Sam, are you going to be upset with me for stealing a branch from a museum? So you want to come here for a because. Welcome to the Co Heritage Museum. Whoa! I offer a great <laughs> tour and I'm happy to discuss the city's Game bug! As well. <laughs> Physics doing weird stuff. Double bone horn. That's my kind of horn. Sorry. <laughs> Hi. Oh, are you a friend of Sam Co? I do so hope you both appreciate the museum. It's about his family, after all. I'd like to talk to you about a tree branch. That is not something <laughs> I expected to hear today. I assume you're somehow associated with the United Colonies. I've received some odd messages of late. Uh-huh. I am helping Mast, yes. Uh, I'm more of a private contractor working freelance. What sort of messages have you received? Several that bordered on being incomprehensible. <laughs> Honestly, I thought it was some kind of strange prank until now. Was it from your man? A bunch of gibberish about dire yep. consequences yep. and frequency yep. and masturbating a tree. And yep. Genetic reconstruction. Uh huh. It all came across as rather unhinged. That checks out hey, for our I boy. It, but we have to collectively let go of this feud with the UC. And besides, this is really just about. <sighs> A tree and someone who is really, really attached to it. Are you defending the UC? I must say, I expected more from a co. Wow! Well, I'm afraid you've wasted your time because I'm not authorized. I'm gonna have to steal a tree to release any of our pieces. That includes hundred year old tree branches. Sorry, but it's staying in storage. Convince her to hand over the branch or steal the branch from the museum. <laughs> it's literally right. I'll try to convince her, but can I ring the bell? No, I can just take the bell. <laughs> Hi. 
please do. right in I front of her <laughs> all the way back to the time of Solomon I really himself. need that tree branch I hear what you're saying but I'm afraid it's out of the question we'll see I could be very annoying when I need to be if you don't give me that branch I won't stop asking for it <laughs> that branch is a vital piece of important xenobotanical work look it's just a branch right a dead piece of wood just let me take it off my off your hands for you right hold on I think this one hmm. I guess right I in front of her bell <laughs> Right. I'm sorry, I was busy picturing you with a tiny hat on your head. <laughs> what? <laughs> I can be very annoying when I need to be. If I don't get that branch, things could be disastrous for the people of New Atlantis. I don't think she cares. I don't think she'll give a shit about the people of New Atlantis. Look, it's just a branch, right? A dead piece of wood. No, I don't think that works either. I really want to say that, but I don't think it will work. You only need a one. That is never going to work, though. I think it cares what you say. Like, I think it cares what you say and you have to pick the right thing for her. I am going to end up having to steal this fucking tree. I am going to have to steal an entire tree. <laughs> That's a good one. I can't believe I'm doing this. Please return it in one piece. What? <laughs> she literally. Well, I hope whatever you're doing with just that branch wanted is worth a it. tiny little hat. I can respect that. Did she give it to me and everything? I didn't even have to go and get it. So much for branching out into theft. <laughs> Somebody clip that, please. Make sure you bring back that branch and a tiny hat. I have the branch. I should get back to Kelton as soon as possible. It's a roundabout way of saying we are, <laughs> we are serious about this whole Wait. thing, really. I mean, it's clear a lot of love was put into it. She really doesn't like this house. Museum. <laughs> this house. <laughs> All right. Well, we did that. <sighs> I feel like I should really do the... Um, which one am I doing? Galbank Vault. Vault. Sam and I should be able to get Solomon's maps now. And then we can go and take that back. Look at how many missions I have. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> it's important that our students know... Okay. Okay. Let's go get the maps. Unbelievable. I don't believe that the tiny hat worked. Go get the bucket. Uh, was Solomon Cole really all that? I think that was a Nord. I just heard a Nord's voice. No, you can leave. <laughs> this is a really uh, reassuring bank, don't you think? Nice mustache. Can I go down there? Hi. Oh, I suppose I'll have to write a report about all of this. William Crowley. Okay, I'll just walk past you. It's fine. What's this? <gasps> Sam, don't look. Don't look. I'm invisible. Okay, this is an advanced one, so I have to actually do... I feel like this one... Oh, it would be really great if that matched up. But it doesn't. So instead, we have that matches some, and then I would have these two and a one. Do I have that? I do. Oh, but they're too they're too far apart. This one works though. No, it doesn't. Never mind. What the heck? For the first row, it's gonna have to be that. That matches up to that one. So that one needs to go there. And then I have two here that need to be done. That doesn't match up. That one's matched up to one on the inside. What on earth?
That one could do that one on the inside. This one does not match up to anything. It matches up to the ones on the inside, which is fine. But what about the outside? So I have a question. If this if this hits one of these, does it matter? Sip. Thank you. I'm not sure I know if it matters or not. I can't do that one because I don't have one that's only one. And that doesn't make sense. So I have one that's four. I have a two... I feel like this one's not right. Don't think it lets you use it? Okay. I feel like this can't be right. So that can't be right either. That's not correct. That has to be one of these. What am I missing here? Like, this doesn't match up with anything on the outside. Can't be that. And if it is that, which it could be, then I have these two and I cannot, like this is too, I can't line these up in any way. I feel like I'm missing something really obvious. Like that does not work. I have three two, no, four twos. You can't see, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I just realized, yeah, I'm gonna have to move my, uh, my camera. Let me see, is this right? Hold on. I'm just making sure I've got this in the right place. Eh. Let me see if that's right. No, my camera's in the wrong place. Hold on. Sorry. Well, okay. It is decided that this is what it looks like. So I'm just going to allow that to be the, the case. Okay, there we go. So this one doesn't fit anything on the outside. This one doesn't fit anything on the outside because it's the extra piece. That one does fit. This one doesn't. Oh, this one fits here. Oh, wait, but I can, can I get that? Oh, I'm just being silly. I'm being silly. So th those two, this one and this one are correct. So then the inside is what I need to worry about now. I was just being silly. Sorry. Sorry for being silly. So for the inside, it would be, oh, not that. That one and that one. That one there is free, but doesn't fit anything. That one there is being used. This one could fit there or there. So that means we need, oh, that one doesn't fit. Do I have one that's, oh, I have this. None of these fit. Wait, yes they do. Yes they do. If I rotate them that way. Which means I have just the two left. Like that. Yeah? Oh, <laughs> 991 credits. Once so you move the key to the right place, if you choose another, then go back to it. It's already lined up. Yes, I learned that yesterday. 
I was just being silly. Ooh, a succulent. He doesn't care if I steal the succulent, but he does care if I steal the money? Ridiculous. <gasps> a terror brew order, but it counts as stealing? <laughs> oh, a nose grub. Wait, does that mean it goes in your nose? Gross. Ha! Succulent. Thank you. What's this? A sculpture. Hi. Um, where was I going? Downstairs, apparently. Okay. We'll take it from here. What are you taking from where? Okay. A vent. Why am I in a vent? Where am I going? <laughs> Woo! Credits. They'll never know. I'm invisible. See. That was kind of what I was trying to do, was rotating through each of them, but I just, I was getting lost. Why are you guys still here? Yes. Oh, what? hi. Nice <laughs> job. Hey, Jed. So damn tired. Go home. I just want to get out of here. Should have thought of that. Oh my God, does this make things into cubes? Dink. <laughs> what did you call me? <laughs> All right. The family has a few different deposit boxes secured in here, so... You gotta come downstairs, or...? Here's a copy of the key. Come on. Search for the maps. Okay, now remember, Solomon was from an earlier generation. Mine. So it's not gonna be on a slate. Big bundle of Big papers bundle of is, paper. what we're after. is what we're after. Not that. An encased alien trilobite? A hypno art lamp and a nose grub paper wit. Hell yeah. Hi, Kai. Good luck for your move. All right, let's see. Note for Sam. I found a note for you. Oh, no. Jacob. Jacob. Of course, that old mule saw Bye, us Dark Smack. See you soon. Sounds like we need to talk to him. I'm walking into drama. This is the part where I walk into drama. Who's Jacob? Why do you take the maps? He's just a bitter old man. Interfering in what's none of his business. Um, sounds like we need to talk to him. Yeah, we do. I was hoping to avoid the estate when we landed. Cora's gonna be so mad. Wash, I do not understand that. Sam, level with me here. Tell me who jo really Jacob is. Yeah. We're going to the estate anyway. I'm going to find out. There's no harm in just telling me. It's clearly a fam family member. Why don't you just tell me? We're going to the estate anyway. Yeah, well, I don't gotta say it. Oh, okay. <laughs> we can't work together if you don't trust me. I know, it's just... It's personal. Freestar Collective, come on. Can't we can't trust another Freestar? But I did technically already do that. Had to pull that one out, did you? <laughs> Get wrecked. <sighs> All right, fine. He's my dad, okay? Oh. We're not exactly on friendly terms. He probably figured I'd come for the have maps daddy at some Got ahead of me. Family business just wasn't something I wanted to get into, you know? Fair. Um, you brought us here. You brought Cora. What about Cora? She and your dad get along? <laughs> God, that's the worst part. They're thick as thieves. Last thing I need is Jacob in her life. Let's leave it at that. Okay. Thanks for opening up to me. Yeah, well, sorry I'm such a pain about it. No forgiveness between me and my old man. I like how he likes it's, that. Uh, co tradition. Okay. All right. Shall we? I guess we're gonna go talk to Sam's dad. Neat. <laughs> Why bars? Um, okay. So Ooh, look at all those Oh, those bugs are not thiefable. I like how they do not value their plants, but they do value their coffee. I respect that. As a person who has killed many, many plants, I respect that. I respect that. Okie dokes, let's go. Hey, go buy ammo. Is there somebody I can buy stuff from here? Ammo, some digi picks, that'd be nice. There's a bar. We have shepherds. What's shepherds? Roland Arms, that sounds like a good place. Hey, oh. You ask me, outlaws? Ashta, those bandits from the Shaw Gang. This can be a dangerous place. Best to carry a reliable piece. I'll take piece. a look at what you got. Don't make me regret this now. I did hear about it being a stola. Someone asked yesterday. 
Uh, she's got an assassin's calibrated solstice. Elegance. Ooh! Shattering. Breakthrough even the strongest armor. Reflex sight. Suppressor. Penetrator rounds. High powered binary trigger. How much is it? 18k? Fuck it. It's mine now. The Zapper! Another rare pistol. That's pretty neat. Sometimes emits electricity where they land that damages and slows nearby targets. That's pretty neat. Um, I do need some ammo. Which pistol? Hold on. I am using... I just bought this. It uses 43. And then... How much 43 do I have, I wonder? Uh, I also use a lot of this, which is 777. So... I would like... Oh, wait. I mean to buy. Um... 43 ultra mag. How many do I have? I have no idea. I'll buy it. And then I need some 777. That's quite a lot of money, but I'll take it. It's a pretty swish looking pistol. I agree. She doesn't have any other stuff. All right, cool. Let's have a little look at that. I think that's good. Damage 69? I think it's like a thingy, like a magnum. I did say ultra mag. Ew. Choose your chunks. Cosmic red apple, baked potato. Why is it got green bits on it? Chunks is such an eyesore in Aquila. Mongolian beef, but, pumpkin uh, pie. Well, I can go for some chunks. <laughs> red cheesecake. Please choose your chunks. Welcome to chunks. Please choose your chunks. Poached egg, chocolate, grilled chicken, and a cheese you stick. Imagine living here. Your muscles would be huge. <laughs> Big potato has chives. Blech. Oh, look, a succulent. Another one. It's not very reassuring the amount of food people have left behind on the tables. Like, we have beef. Wine? Wine? A red wine flavored chunks food cube. They have wine chunks. Our chunks now. Playing card. Wine. A succulent. Nobody likes Thanks their succulents. For choosing chunks. Which chunks would you like today? I don't know, Welcome man. Welcome to Chunks, home of the best chunks in the settled system. <laughs> what exactly are chunks made of? I wonder how many chunks you could fit into the pockets of your jacket. Honestly, you're probably better off not thinking about it. I'd like to buy some chunks. I'm happy to serve you. Please stop saying chunks. <laughs> chunks, apple, beef, cake, cheese steak, chick, chick, just chick, a chicken flavored chunks feed cube. Choco, cola, egg, pie, potato, and wine. He was serving you new co a coffee in New Atlantis. Really is future dystopia. Oh, he was Adam Jensen. Okay, interesting. What are the shops we have here? We have the museum here. What's this? I can't read that. Enhance? Oh, that's to change your face, I think. I do want to do that at some point. I don't know if I like my character anymore. Cake Chunks was your stripper name at uni. I bet it was. Uh, where, what kind of weird alleyway have I gone down? Where does this go? To the prison? No. We're not going to jail today. to protect people from the Ashta. We're on the same side here. To Chunka. The hell with that. This ain't the way things are done. And that's the end of it. With due respect, I have repeatedly explained that I do not need permission. I, I came to you in the spirit of cooperation. Oh, I'm really enjoying it, yours, Trudy. reaction. 20 years. That is my way. And it is always worth it. Always. Why are you trying to fix something that ain't broke? What's happening? Mr. Wilson, we can deal with the ash to better, safer. We didn't turn down fire or uh, space flight because we managed just fine until that point. I will not be talked down to like this. Okay. I like how Sam just Mr. went and had a seat. 
please don't take any further action until we've had some time to think this over. All right? You probably done anything because the character creation took so long. Smarter, better in the way we handle the Ashta. Okay. Talk to me. Friend, I gotta confess. I'm not much in the mood for conversation. Yeah, that's fair. I know. I shouldn't let that woman get up under my skin, but... Well, I can't seem to help it. What happened, bud? What was that all about, anyway? Girl comes in here with her big ideas about how we defend our city. No respect for the way we've done things for years. No worries about the possible consequences. And expect us to thank her for making our lives more difficult. <laughs> Ask him questions, even though you said he doesn't want to talk about it. <laughs> like that. So it all sounded pretty overblown. I assure you, it is not. Look, this ain't New Atlantis. It ain't all. I'm Free Star Collective, sir. Birds out there. These walls around us, they're here for a damn good reason. I've trained the guards here for years again for a damn good reason we get it wrong we not watching all the time then the ash to kill innocent people that's the simple reality of the situation okay so what do you suggest someone struts in the town with their untested ideas on how to do things better than those of us who dedicated our lives to protecting the city that don't go over so well okay what's she trying to do I don't know some technical mumble jumble about sensors and behavior predictions. That's not the point. She expect us to just change up how things work and I can't abide by it. We've gotten along just fine until now. I think they're both wrong. You take this pretty seriously. How could I not? People in this city put their trust in me to keep them mumbo safe. jumbo indeed. Look, what was that this noise? Is my blood pressure up talking about this so damn that was a ship. You think you can talk some sense into her? Be my guest. Otherwise, Protect your peace. I suggest you leave defending this city to the people who spent their lives doing it. Protect your peace. Okay, I'll talk to her. Where'd she go? If it weren't for the walls, where'd she go? <laughs> Is she in the house? Hold on a second. Is it an activity? Uh, no, that's. I did visit the London landmark on Earth. I must have scanned it or something. Red tape blues, mantis. Oh, I find a note about a secret outpost on a dead spacer. Huh? Did I? Notes. What was it called? I have stolen so many things. Oh, I need to get rid of these. I need to get rid of these. What's it called? Read the what? Where'd it go? Oh my god, where'd it go? Here, read the secret outpost slate. Secret, secret outpost. <laughs> secret outpost. I got two of them. Loyal to your crew. I get it, but screw that. Beg, borrow, steal, kill to get to Denebola. I B one B. I'm not sure. There's a secret outpost we're trying to crack. Once in a lifetime opportunity. You will regret it for the rest of your life if you don't get your ass over here. Okay, so that's the same one twice. All right, cool. We got a secret tunnel. I outpost. Failure to communicate. Nope. Uh. Nope. Nope. Uh. What is this one called? Where is she? Where did she go? Around here think we own the she has mm, fucked off. Let's go right now. I think we might be, but I also I'm kind of feeling like I'm just gonna faff around here for quite a while. I got so much to do in this settlement already, and I haven't even got started. I just got here. I don't know where that lady went, and I can't see the mission in my list. Must have been the wind. She's gone. She's gone forever. Goodbye, sweet princess. <laughs> all right friends i'm gonna finish up soon because i feel like we have a lot of quests to do and this feels like a nice enough place to start uh i'm not sure what the situation will be with regards to monday perhaps we should go to the secret outpost rock might have some work for someone like you 
because that's not story stuff and then I won't be spoiling anybody on Monday while I'm doing the stream. So maybe we'll do that and we'll come back. Come back to Aquila, do all the things later. I did get a really nice new gun. Let me make sure I have that set up. Whoops, that's not what I meant to do. Stop that. Um, this one, yeah, okay. So I have this set up, look. My new gun. It's pretty nice. Gonna do some work. Is there a toilet to save up at? There's a toilet in here. I could drop all my, uh, I could drop all my Watch succulents green. in here. Ready for what comes next. Hold on. Let me see. What can I help you? Also, with? I'm very pleased that I. There we go. I'm very pleased that I managed to not have my camera crash again. Plant. Many succulents. No, don't do that. I didn't want to drop. I don't. I don't want to pick it up. I want to drop it again. What did I pick up? I picked up a uh, another succulent. There we go. Perfect. This is my toilet. I'm scared to drop the cat in case I lose it. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> gonna do a full save there. I just heard that noise from the cold coming from the toilet. And they're like, is she okay? <laughs> I'm pooping succulents. All right, friends. I had a really good time today. Thanks for the rare, rarely spotted, not often spotted uh, Saturday stream. Had a great time. So here's the deal. I was going to be streaming Starfield tomorrow, but I'm not going to be now. My next stream of Starfield will be on Monday from London, from the countdown to launch event, which is very exciting. Hashtag ad because they're, they're flying me out and it's a sponsor stream. Bonus PJ stream was great. 